guys. I hope you're doing well. We here with a special All Signs series reading. This is live. We're going to be seeing who is it that you will be with and who is it that you won't be with between 2023 and 2026. What contracts are on the way out? What contracts are on the way in? We obviously do have a stellium currently in Venus ruled sign of Libra. And an eclipse coming in that very sign. So the name of the game here are contracts. Justice right there. And ones that come in. And ones that move move out of our story. Okay, so for good. And that's what I hear. So, but yeah, let's see in um, closer detail what for each of the signs this may look like. And uh, we'll try to get as specific as possible. Thank you guys so much for hitting the like button. It really does help this video. It helps this channel subscribing, hitting the like button sooner in the video as you're watching. Um, YouTube takes that into consideration and uh, yeah, the interaction is what they're looking for. So the more that you're interacting with the video, sharing, liking, subscribing, commenting. Yeah, the more that they will um, support this content in the algorithm space. So yeah, thank you guys for your role there. You do play one. The six of wands here in the father pentacles. Let's get into it. We're going to start here with the sign of Libra. Libra, what's going on? Let's clear the energy. Return to sender. Let's jump in. Who is it that's leaving your life? Who is it that won't be there anymore in terms of a contract between 2023? Okay. Who's just going to be not on the register list kind of thing um and who will okay so thank you guys for tuning in you have a water sign leaving your uh your life okay this person here won't be as active in your story as they were let's click on the back The issue here with this person was the throw chakra, okay? They had a really hard time. You had a really hard time finding commonality, okay? So this person and you, I see you very much not in alignment in many, many ways. I see this person leaving, leaving your story, especially if you are a masculine Libra. You may realize this person can give you what you're looking for, okay? Six of Cups in Reverse. Five of Wands in reverse. Okay, yeah. So um, some of you as well. Could be that this person, yeah, this is a south node contact for you. Um, who else? Is there anyone else that I'm hearing Virgo that Libra will be detaching from? Yeah, we're seeing strong Virgo energy as well. I see you letting go of a contract here that's related to Virgo. So it may not be a person, right? We can have contracts with, with things. You, I see you letting that go, that Six of Pentacles in reverse right there. Um, anything else here? It could be related to a home or a property. It could be even a friend circle. It could be a, a space you just un end up unsubscribing to, um, like a community even. Okay, anything else? Anybody else? Yeah. Um, you're also going to hear return. to Something is very, very controversial. You're going to decide I don't want to have nothing to do with this place. I'm hearing that this space, like someone you're going to hear talking shit. It could be your business, co your, your co-workers. Um, like you just like want to get the hell out of there. That's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing franchising. Okay, let's get into the next um, phase of this read, which is, oh, let's get some letter. Uh, yeah, let, let's get into now who's coming into your story. New contracts for the sign of Virgo. I'm smelling some kind of kebab. <laughs> Maybe someone here is Middle Eastern. Oh, it smells really delicious, whatever that is. Like it's some kind of stew, like boiling. Mm, wow, it sm smells like mm, some kind of... I'm hearing even like a chutney, but I see it like wood burning. Return to sender. Return to sender. Is some 
Let's clear that. Yeah. Some kind of chutney. It smells so good. Oh my god, Libra. Listen. Hook it up for a girl. Mm, comment. Oh, what the hell is that? That <laughs> you're eating there because I mean, I'll show, yeah. Invite me. Okay. I'm over. Yeah. I'm here. <laughs> I'm hearing something about salt. Salt and air. <laughs> Salt and air could be the name of a place. I don't know. Maybe discover a new restaurant. You got a new cord hook up there. <laughs> yeah, you're going to start going there more often. I don't know. Or if it's just like to good food in general. Okay, you're going to start. Look at this. That's it. This means being selfish. Let me be selfish. Yeah, hey, you're going to be enjoying your life there with the, the whole food thing. I see you making some kind of bubbly stew. Wow. It's kind of like got like a wood burning, sour, even some kind, something exotic that mm -hmm, right there. Anyways. Oh, yeah. You want to come over? I'm baking it now. <laughs> I got it on the stove ready right here. You may be making friends like when it comes to your cooking, just saying, OK, maybe you're going to open like a food based business for some. I see you getting really into that. Um, yeah, you're like cooking different types of stews. Getting really into like stews. You're cooking. I'm just tasting this very particular stew. I don't know what that is, but it's something like even you get really into it and then you keep making it. You keep doing it. You know, you get obsessed with whatever that is. Um, take it as you will. Yeah, maybe you're eating a lot of that. Just saying, okay, the two of animals. But yeah, anyways, that's not the point, right? This is really turning you on. It's something with, with yeah, your passion. Definitely. Oh my God, you're eating a lot, Libra. <laughs> Listen, but I don't blame you, okay? It's like some of you, you're getting obsessed with whatever this is. Churn, baby, churn. Yeah, and you're enjoying making it too. It's really exciting. By the way, I have the chat on members only because the trolls are just too crazy this week. Okay, so we just got to... The sun lovers don't want to stress the mods and everyone else out here the lovers six of swords the sun the ten of pentacles thank you guys by the way for joining members okay so yeah chop 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 like you are making something here you're yeah you are I, I don't know i keep seeing your social life is related maybe you're throwing parties and cooking uh, let's get here another person or contract coming in for you between 2023 and 2026 thank you guys so much for hitting the like button Let's get at least 50 likes before we close Libra out. Who is this? Oh my God. Libra. Somebody's going to be running back to you. This is an axe of yours. Mm -hmm. They really miss you. I'm hearing the name Bandit here. Hi, doll. This person's running, running back your way. This is another contract. Um, yeah, they want a new start with you, this person. I'm hearing Minerva. That's the place in Italy. I'm hearing... Because I was walking with a ghost... I said, please, please don't hesitate. Yeah, what's that song? Knight of Pentacles. Oh. Six of Swords in reverse. They're going to try to open this back up with you, Libra. Let's clear the energy. They want to know, like, how you been. I'm here. I want to know what love is. Ba, 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 ba. I want to know what love is. Do you have the same idea that I do in mind these days when it comes to love? Like, they want to hook up. Oh, they want to hook up with you again. Who is this? Can we get a little more? Like, what's your history? Some of you, they want to prove they're not the same person. Yeah. Oh, the Queen of Cups. Um, For some of you, this may be that person who you detach from. They may try to come back in. They're going to, you guys are going to have a phase where you separate. And it may be depending with a wheel of fortune. Yes. Yeah, spirit is saying, yeah, as well, that it really depends. Like you may get into this really fun energy, like as a s solo, I'm hearing entrepreneur. Maybe that was someone, it was a coworker. That person may have time to really process. Okay. What was going on there? I don't know for everybody, right? That's not really the point of this read more. So this is just like, who's coming and who's leaving. And we got every sign to move through. So we got to keep it a little more brief, but for the sake of, yeah, this read this, um, Person, it may try to come back in once. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
you're going to have separation. Then I see them coming in. I see something about camel tones. You guys maybe did fashion together. Three of swords. Six of cups. I see you guys making friends. Okay. For some, that's not for everybody. I see a chicken thigh leg. I don't know what that's about. Let's get further. Thank you guys for the like button. Hit the like button if this is resonating. If you like this content, it really does make a difference. Right now, act yeah. In active time, YouTube is calculating how many people are hitting the like button and how soon in, in during the video. Really, really, they do look at it like that. And if enough people are hitting the like button, if we're resonating enough with this content to the point where we're hitting that like button, YouTube is going to change the algorithm on where this video goes on YouTube. It can even get posted to people who are not looking for tarot readings. It'll just pop up. I mean, how cool would that be? So yeah, thank you guys for again playing a role there. Hitting the like button, it really does make a difference. Also, the down like whatever any form of interaction we got. V, 10 of cups in reverse. This is someone you worked with that you were friends with. I feel like, yeah, you guys are going to, again, I'm going to call it like this, separate, and then you come back together like in a different, in different context. Some of you may have boundaries though. Like some of you don't want to be around this person anymore. I'm hearing the name Michael. You know, it's, it's depending. Um, I'll put one card for the health of, in the long term of this. You know what? It's really going to depend. Yeah. Seven of cups in reverse. Um, I feel like this person is destined to come back into your story. However, it, the the context really has to be right. And that's where Spirit is saying with that Wheel of Fortune energy, like, it has to be appropriate. It's so much about the appropriate, appropriateness. We're not desperate for this to take off again. Um, the foundation has to be correct. Two of Swords. Ace of Cups, yeah. So can we get a little bit more in the Moon in Reverse? Yeah, maybe they have to get... Okay, let's... Who is it as well that's coming in? Like, can we get any more between 2020... To 2023 and 2026. Man, you have a lot of exes. What's going on with this whole, like, I have regrets about how I treated you back there thing? Okay, we got the Seven of Wands. Let's clear the engine and let's say, buddy, the higher fun up right. This is someone who did you dirty. Some of you, this person, like, I get the feeling they, like, stole something from you and they want to give it back now. It's like they kind of saw their ways. They want to like talk again. This is a possibly a Capricorn, a Taurus, a Libra. They may have those uh, energy spotlighted in their birth chart. That this is someone who wants to sort of apologize and give you something. Okay, in that space of apology, can we get a little bit more? Um, who is coming back into? I'm hearing something about Jeffrey Campbell. Some of you may get new shoes. Just saying. Okay, let's get further. New contracts for Libra between 2023 and 2026. We have the Four of Cups. Okay, this can be a contract to a place. It could be a cord that is to a place, a new place. Ooh, this is some shit right here. Yeah, sign me up. If you were to cook that stew and set the place up looking like that, I'll be, I'll be there. Because, <laughs> oh, man, that was a song. <laughs> I'll be there. I'll be at your place. This thing just popped up. Enhance ad privacy in Chrome. <laughs> Sorry, not. <laughs> if you want to get with my lover. Is that how the song? Oh, no, that's not how the song goes. Um, if you want to be my lover, you got to get with my Chrome settings. <laughs> I don't know if I can, like, I don't know if I can put you on the list. Like, mm. okay, Libra, I guess you're too cool for us now. Enjoy the stew. <laughs> we may not be seeing you. <laughs> After, oh, nah. Take, scratch may make a June. Sorry, I can't be there. What happened? It's like, you're not, it's like you keep putting it off, putting oh, I'm not coming. Sorry, no, I'm not coming this Christmas. Sorry. You're with somebody, you're enjoying, you're enjoying the best of your life, Libra. Something about Kansas. Some of you, you're just enjoying the shit out of your life. Okay, right here. Now, let me see. Um. Anyways. I'm here and I'm a stone. I'm a, I'm a stone's throw away. I'm here because uh, I'm one call away. Dun 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 
you're you're really feeling yourself with the empress you feel you're feeling whatever this is you're gonna love what this is some of you it's a new car it's your lifestyle it's a place it's a but damn just meditate on that i mean what does that feel for you you know you are gonna be enjoying that okay i'm just say it all right and it's like i feel you're more like exclusive it's like you don't you know, when you're enjoying, you don't have to like extrovert it. It's like, if you're really enjoying the bubble bath, you don't need to FaceTime while you're in the bathtub, right? I mean, I'm hearing it like that. People going to find you like more exclusive, the sun. Some of you, you're going to be very busy, okay? Um, it's your glow up right there. Empress in the, absolutely. Like, but that's more like glow in. You're glowing in, from within. Mm -hmm. You're really, um, you're loving your, your life. I hear that. You're loving, you're loving who you've become, what you've created. This is high vibrational li Libra, right? Energy. So Knight of Wands in reverse. Let's get a little bit further. Um, some of you as well, like I see you're like not really get return to center. You're not really getting hung up on relationship stuff. Like, you know, I see you like kind of just being more free and open. Like I'm not getting hung up on like when we hooks up. Okay. I'm not going to like get so focused on that. I'm hearing that. Like you're very independent. I see that with the Empress. You're like where you're at. So you're okay being independent. Any other contracts coming in for Libra between 2023 and 2026? <gasps> wow. Alyssa. Nice. Okay. We have the eight of cups. Something of a routine. The Empress is going to see. Is this going to improve your 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 lifestyle? Okay, I'm seeing your sleep, your health. Um, your, it's your sanctuary energy. I see the Eight of Cups as like a place of solace. Okay, a place of honesty. What's that song by Zayn? Um, da 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 war zone. Yeah, the sun. It's like yeah, you've got the perfect pillow for like yeah that song now. You can really sing it and really really sing it. Like I don't know, you think it as well. Some of you that might be like a message. Oh God. Some of you, um, something going, listen, I'm just going to say you're enjoying yourself and your environment will, will be able to, yeah, you'll be able to sort of, yeah, not, not mm, two of cups. Yeah. So for instance, like you used to like have to, but this is the fly again. You used to have to like, you had, you're dating someone that used to have to come over like your place. You had a roommate or whatever, your, your family's house. I don't know. You used to live with your friends. Return to center. Let's say buddy. Now you have your own place. Okay. Sex is going to get better. Just saying, okay, you're not going to be worrying, like, you know, about people walking in and out. Just saying. <laughs> All right, Libra. Let's get some sage. I see you more exclusive. It's like you have your own place now. You're not going to be answering the phone as often, you know, because people can't just show up. It's like, that's for some, like, you know, you're having alone time. Okay, some of you are on vacation. Like, you're feeling yourself, okay? You have that time to yourself here like that. You don't, yeah. You're not, yeah, you're not as accessible. Um, yeah, you used to like have maybe a roommate co-living, community living situation. You have your own place. So yeah, let's get into the next read. Thank you so much for tuning in. Some of you, you may go from like living in an apartment to living in a house. Uh, sign two, Taurus. Thank you so much for tuning in. We are over that threshold of 50 likes. Thank you guys so much for support. Hitting like button. Let's try to get to at least 100 likes during Taurus to get into the next sign. Thank you so much for your support. We have the nine of swords. Okay, who are you leaving behind, Taurus? Who are who is Taurus leaving behind? Spirit, some bullshit, some some big old BS that you had no business dealing with. I'll say it like that. I mean, this was just some silliness. The Nine of Swords and the High Priestess, the Death card. You know, yeah. So you're gonna go through a moment here. You're gonna move through. Yeah, definitely. Um, you're gonna release this. I'm hearing you're gonna look back and be like, that was childish. Okay, yeah, it could be a Pisces, a Scorpio, or an energy, you know, your sinistry. You, you was bringing this Neptune shadow out. It was bringing Pluto shadow. You know, it was bringing this delusional energy even. Like, uh, in the sense of you looking back, being like, why did I, what, what? <laughs> what in the hell? I'm hearing Wilfred, Seafried, Seafried? Hmm. Frida, Friedman's, Freeman's? I don't know. Anyways. Okay, could be some Sag energy there as well. Can we get a little bit further? What contracts will Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, North Node placements, Jupiter placements be releasing during this 2023 to 2026? I'm hearing dice. Right there we have the Fool. Obviously the Fool is Uranian. It makes me think of dice. Um, 
yeah, because it's kind of risky. You know, you're taking that wild card sort of shot at some opportunity. And some of you here are going to realize that I don't know what the hell I was again. You know, there's a lot of this. Like, I don't know what I was thinking back there. We had the Empress, the Tower. Yeah, you were going to like live it all out even lavishly for some, it was something impractical. Yeah, I see you just being like, no, nah, you're going to scratch that idea. And you're going to go more into it. We'll see what you're going to move towards instead because you're definitely going to reinvest whatever this is in a new in a new direction. But yeah, this is definitely not going to work, whatever that was. The five, yeah. Some of you are going to, um, hmm. there's someone, uh, there's somebody, uh, I'll be honest, some of you may have to break up with someone you thought you were going to have a future with. It's not going to work with that person, okay? What we're seeing there is really strong Libra, Aquarius, really strong Capricorn, and Gemini, okay? Like that person, like, you know, it's one of those moments like that wasn't me. That was them. Like I was taking on traits of theirs. Like I, they sold me on that dream. I don't even want to live in that mansion. I'm hearing that something was, yeah, I don't know. You're going to realize something about that, but yeah, don't claim it. If it's not resonating, you know, this is not for everybody, right? Every channel message you make your own. If it's meant to be yours, it should sit with you in a healthy sort of grounded way. We have judgment. Mm -hmm. What are you moving into judgment? The King of Pentacles. So you need open, honest communication, Taurus. You, my friend, Taurus, you need someone who can talk. Straight talk. Open talk. Not be shady. You know? Um, that's what's going to really appeal to you during this period. Uh, between these next few years. These next few years, I see really kind of like honoring communication. You know, needing, needing communicative standards Matt, is going to be something that you get quite serious about okay like uh you're going to dump someone if they can't communicate properly with you you're going to just kind of let go of that relationship okay that that connection if you can't respect how you also operate in that space when it comes to communication like if you start acting shady and like not wanting to communicate and you're realizing you're that's not return to you are ruled by venus venus rules the throw chakra some of you like yeah if you're a singer as well if you feel like you can't create to your fullest to your height in a certain space you know maybe it's a duet you're singing with someone that's in a band you're not feeling it you're gonna have to step away from that space and communication is number one king of pentacles judgment i see you wanting preference for the practical okay maybe you got kind of like carried out at sea taurus with this like neptunian hazy rose colored sort of energies with that really strong pisces that was with that really strong scorpio maybe that that's what you sort of deduce you know like i don't know what what that was you feel like you were under some spell or something it's skipping really really guys if you can hear me all right can you type two one two Yeah. Um, some of you are also going to be looking for someone stable. Okay. It could be an actual King of Pentacles coming in. This could also be you. Okay. I feel like you're like, I would rather be alone if someone's going to come into my life and make my life a living nightmare and a communication, a communication. Yeah. Just a disaster. Okay. There's something th that was just falling apart, you know, because of the yeah lack of communication, even the lack of it. Maybe it started to make you feel really paranoid. What's going on? Michelle's saying skipping. If you can hear me right now, can you type 444? I don't know what, what do you mean skipping? Okay, so let's just continue. Ten of Cups here. You're realizing as well, Taurus, like your happiness and someone may come in and show you that, like how much it's important. What do you mean it's skipping nonstop? No sound. That doesn't make any sense. I don't know why that would be. Is it the ads that are running? Okay, I'm gonna continue, guys. All right, because uh, I see I see people saying it's working for them. 
Yeah, I see. I see. So it must be the ads. The Ten of Cups here, the Two of Cups. I think YouTube started to play ads in the middle of the, the video. So Seven of Pentacles in reverse, the Six of Pentacles of right, Queen of Swords. Yeah. King of Swords, Queen of Swords. So, so there, someone is going to help you realize, Taurus, how much you need to be able to communicate with someone when it comes to your fulfillment, your happiness. Okay. Um, also feeling you can share that space with maybe your hobbies, your passions that involve your throat chakra. Like let's say you're a singer, maybe you were dating someone who did, was not really into, you know, music. Uh, you're going to realize, no, I want to be with someone who actually wants to like, yeah, you know, that's important for me. I'm hearing that feeling like you guys can really communicate. That's what I'm hearing. Maybe your, fo your form of communication, you are maybe someone who's more poetic or you're, I mean, keep your eye on, you're a singer, you know, for you to activate your throat shock, you're going to realize like, I need that. I, I, I can't be with someone who I just say, Hey, what's up? How was your day going? And then that's it. It's like, no, like we need to be able to really expose our, yeah, our heart space in, in, in ways that I'm going to realize here during this next few years. So Michelle, uh, Samantha says she refreshed it and now it's working for her. So maybe refresh it. That's strange. I don't know why the judgment seven wants. Yeah. So, um, that's what I'm saying. You know? Yeah. Maybe you were with, you know, it's just, you have to have that compatibility factor. It may be a factor of your compatibility. You'll realize like you need to have, um, you know, it's like, I didn't realize how like also unhappy I was back there, how unfulfilled I was. Like someone was here more, um, it was more mystical, you know? And I feel like you're going to now crave and to the point where you'll, you'll pursue, um, a relationship where you have more, more flavor in, in the way that you do interact. It's not just about what you communicate. It's also the consistency that's important to you. Sorry, guys. I just all of a sudden need to back. Wow, what a Taurus moment, huh? <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> I don't know what was st stuck to that. All right. So, yeah. I feel like you're going to end up respecting this person so much. You know, you're going to be relieved. Like, wow, I didn't know that was the factor. You know, that was a, that factor I needed to be attended to in my relationship, you know, with someone not having that really was causing you like a lot of heartache. So you could just have that touched on and, and you'll see a totally different relationship dynamic. And many of you, you'll move out of those shadow Neptune, shadow Pluto connections where you were there for like some unknown reason, but this person was just draining your energy. It sounds very karmic. It sounds very South node energy. So yeah, very exciting. I feel like you're also going to feel um, that the, the sex is more colorful with whoever this is. Um, you're realizing that communication really is important when it comes to having like a strong sex life connection. Um, when you're able to communicate, you're not, it's not just a physical thing. You're able to communicate and maybe there are things that you need to communicate and there are things that you need to communicate about what it is that you want, that you feel, you know, maybe yeah. with a past partner, you were barely talking and you didn't even have time to like take this aspect of you from, from within you and, and to extend to another person, like in that intimate space. So yeah. Um, anything, anybody else or any other, I think it's very exciting that Taurus, I'm really happy for you. Let's see here. We go further. That came through in your October read. So it may be someone you meet during October. Feel free to check out that October read. Oh, wow. King of Wands. Wheel of Fortune. So Spirit is saying that you may meet this person. It's not for certain. You may be sort of clocking in this timeline, uh, this Wheel of Fortune and this King of Wands. There's an opportunity for you to meet this person here. Let's see here. Who is this? 
Some of you, they drive a Cadillac. They love to go to the museum. You may meet them on a social app or something like that. Um, I mean, uh, for you guys are saying we're still deciding if this is what we want to do. Uh, yeah, with, 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 with what you're doing in your life, uh, your soul path. We're seeing about your soul path. We have to see if this person is really they're still they're feeling his timeline out okay with the king of wands it's not for certain yet i'm here in rush rush this person um is that the devil that's the devil they got to see if this person can really uh, i'm here in titanium if if they can really last in this relationship with you um it could be an ex. They are closely monitoring this person, their entities. They have to make sure that they are really clear of entities before. Yeah, they, they, this is not something they're rushed to, to bring through. Your spirit guides are, mon like I say, monitoring this person. You know, um, could be a fire sign. Something about a Christmas present. This person, yeah, they, they're they being watched by spirit very, very closely. They're um, there's heavy scrutiny here with their with their bloodline. For however, reason they're being monitored. Um, yeah, yeah. So they have an entity, you guys. They did, they have an entity, and spirit is not sure, you know. Um they gotta do do a few more checks on this person. We may have to update this read later to see, you know, because this is not a clear call yet. Um, yeah. Um, something's still a bit sloppy on his end. He has yet to ascend in certain ways that it's just not going to return. Yeah, it's not going to work for you. I'm here in Mitchell. Yeah, your spirit, mm -hmm, the sun reverse. So even before they even bring this in, like they don't want to make a deal out of it because they don't know. It's like it's all here, Shakira. It's all in the it's in the air right now. We don't know. Like we uh, this he has to prove himself, and we're not going. I mean, this is not a, we are not desperate. You don't need somebody like. If anything, you know who knows? Maybe he's just coming in just to be like, hey, I'm here. You want to hang out? And maybe it, that's all that the point is of that contract. Like, it's maybe not that big of a deal, okay, to you. But, yeah, they need something here that, yeah, the devil again in reverse. So maybe they have an addiction. There's something. Like, spirit is not rushing to get this person back into your story anytime soon. Um, but if they can ascend quickly enough, then, you know, I see that, yeah, there could be some kind of calibration, recalibration, justice, upright energy between you and that person something about california they have to get honest about something with you as well like if they're not going to be able to you know and the question is are they ascending to the level and degree that you are you know you've changed a lot like with that really strong experience that you move through right knowing now <clears throat> what you do about communication throw chakra return to center i'm hearing Alyssa, elisa lisa it's all in relative aspect you have transcended this person you know maybe yeah, they're also transcendent, but by now, you know, do we have more expectations? Is it just not on the same timeline right now? We don't know again. Yeah, I see the devil. Okay, again, right there. At the base of that judgment card that we pulled alongside temperance, this is not someone that your guides honestly think you need to carry your, your stuff out. It's not really for you anymore. It's more for the... Just fly. This... um clear throw chakra right in the crown this content and the way that you deliver it um it's it's not really necessary okay the two of wands queen of pentacles this is about them actually because they they may be feeling kind of like guilty i'm seeing with that queen of wands there, there's this very strong and marked eagerness like this person return it again to center in the sacral like they you're their dream honestly um They can't just be with you, you know, like they're working really hard to be that person. But that doesn't necessarily, you know, there's so much more that goes into your, from your guides vantage point. You're very protected. You're very watched over. Let's get into the next sign. Uh -huh. Your guides are, they don't just have, want you with anybody. <laughs> All right, Gemini. Let's get into Gemini. 
Who are you leaving behind, Gemini Tower? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm here. Okay, just let's clear. Three of Wands. What in the Scrooge? The Three Scrooges. The Eight of Cups. Um, This is drama. This is something you maybe were entertained by for a certain period of time, and then you're all of a sudden going to be like, you know what, fuck this. I don't want to be in this drama shit show bullshit. You know, I can't. I can't. And I see you dropping it completely, letting it go. You know, you'd rather lose this than be wound up in it, okay? This was even, like, something, like, you were doing. Like, oh, this is dramatic. Let's get here further. What are you letting go of? What are you letting go of? What contracts are you letting go of? Lovers. Some of you, you could have a, multiple options. You were two-timing. I'm saying, oh. Yeah, you were maybe leading someone on an earth sign. You got to tell them, hey, it's just not going to work between us. Are you King of Swords. Could have been same sex. We have the Nine of Cups. Like, yeah, you had to, like, get honest. Like, hey, I don't see a future, actually. Okay, some of you, you knew, like, if from the start kind of energy is what I'm picking up on, Gemini. Who are you coming into? The King of Cups upright. This is possibly an X, a water sign. Who is coming in for the sign of Gemini during 2023 and 2026? Please, Spirit, Queen of Swords, Lovers. Ooh. I'm going to be honest here, okay? This, yep, King of Pants right there with the King of Swords. You are going to say bye to one person and you're going to choose to be with that other person. Is it controversial? Yeah. Is it going to be like, oh my God, what you yeah, but yeah, yeah, but you're gonna be a Gemini about it. <laughs> I'm here into it's like you're gonna make that decision. I'm here in foolish. Like some people are gonna be like, you just ruined your reputation. I mean, I was like, but I gotta be honest. Like you're gonna just go, you're gonna go off the rail maybe with your reputation with something because you're in love. Like I'm here in you. You don't care anymore. I'm here and I want to be with him. I'm here in that. You there's a water sign. You're gonna I see break up with an earth sign and you're gonna. You're going to move towards this water sign. Somebody from your past may come through. This is, again, like we're saying, a bit controversial possibly, but it is a Gemini reading. <sighs> um, you got an ex, okay? Possibly who's going to return a water sign. This person is really the one you want to be with. I hear it like that. And you're realizing, you know what? I don't want to ever be with this person here in King of Pentacles. Like, I don't know what I would say. He was maybe, you know, kind of holding place for you. Just being honest. Okay, yeah. Is it Shadow Gemini? Not necessarily. Okay, maybe some of you, you know, you realize it's too late in the connection. You know, Gemini is curious. You get, you get, let's go in the sake. Oh my God, I'm feeling this queasy energy. Like my stomach is tumbling. Like you were thinking maybe you would, but no, I'm sorry. Bye bye. Like you had to push this person away. You started to feel claustrophobic. Like it's one of those moments where you just know, like this person is just not for you. Okay. And you're feeling like uh, frustrated or irritated that you're feeling locked down. Okay. Yeah, and this overly traditional, maybe even type of connection. It's like they were really into it. They were more into it than you were. And you could just feel that. And like, ugh, I don't know. You didn't like that feeling of like where everything was also okay. Like you wanted to really be with this king of cops. Okay. Who was like maybe even like pushing you away a bit at a certain point. But I feel like you, I gotta be honest, like you have more respect for this person. You feel more compatible. By the way, guys, please hit the like button. Thank you so much for hitting the like button on this video. Um, yeah, it really does make a difference on this channel. Hitting the like button sooner than not during the reading while you're watching it in the live, especially really does help boomerang this video out in the algorithm further to other potential viewers. And so you do make a, make a huge difference with that. Know that, um, yeah, spirit and, and YouTube is watching, uh, yeah, how, how active you are in this content. So claim the portal. Um, and yeah, thanks for your support. Let's get further. Queen of swords. Yeah. This, this is someone you already know, like in your back of your mind, Gemini, you knew if this person ever returns, I'm going to be with them. I just know it. I mean, and knowing that, was it kind of horrible that you were dating this other person? I mean, maybe, I don't know. Like, I feel like you were so sold on this, okay? You just know it in your heart space. Like, I can't have eyes for any other man that I did for this person. Now, some of you here, it could be same sex. It could be two masculines. <sighs> this is the person you want. This person is your is your lover. I'm hearing that. I'm hearing that song by Taylor Swift. My lover. Yeah. Anyways, something about studying, studying abroad. Like... You, you just, yeah, you couldn't get over this person. I'm hearing that as well. Like, you never did. Some of you, the sex was amazing. It was just, it was perfect for you. You felt it was very compatible. It was, yeah. So that's what I'm seeing. You guys could be a strong Gemini, Aries, air sign. 
a Libra, Aquarius, or Gemini in their chart with really strong water. And I'm getting Scorpio specifically. But anyways, let's get into the next sign. Cancer. Who are you releasing? Who was walking out? We got the King of Cups. We got the King of Pentacles. And the King of Swords. I'm hearing Johnny, John. So, Cancer, um, someone was really into you. I feel like you know that. And you needed to give this person an absolute judgment call. And it reminds me of what we just read on with, with, with Gemini. If you have a lot of Gemini or Cancer or you're a cusper, this is definitely, um, yeah, you read. But what I'm getting kind of is interesting because this is actually the, well, okay, well, just take it as you will. This, this um, like, interpret it in your way. I'm not going to focus so much on, like, compare it comparatively how it may, you know, add up with the archetype of, of Gemini. But um, I'm seeing something about M&Ms. Some of you, this person, um, you know, you cannot see a future with them, okay? They have a lot of water in their chart, I'm seeing. They could maybe be too similar to you or something like this. Return to the third eye, ten of pentacles in reverse. Some of you, something about the business, the company that they work for, something was controversial, like you couldn't relate maybe to what they did for a living. Some of you felt embarrassed around this person sometimes, like three of cups here, um, the six of pentacles. I'm not saying that that's like, that. yeah, but I'm just, I'm just channeling here. So this is what I feel you were feeling. Um, ten of pentacles in reverse. Hmm. Six of swords. Like you kept, I feel it's one of those relationships I'm here seeing red hot chilies. You kind of slowly were coming down to this realization, like, this is not going to work. This is not going anywhere, like, better. If anything, we're arguing more. I'm just feeling the loss. Like, you already were sort of detaching the cord before you actually detach. Let's return to center. You were feeling farther from this person, like, more detached. Like, it was awkward. You were living together even. And, like, it was just, this wasn't for you, Cancer. I'm going to get into the next um what are you releasing cancer that's challenging though that that contract the five of wands the world because maybe at a certain point like it what yeah just let's clear a lot has changed five of swords could be a company though like we're saying um and i feel like most of all the thing that separates you from that person are the morals you just you don't feel like you can really see where they're coming from when it comes to the decisions they're making in their life anyways um if you're cross watching that person could have been a bit prejudiced just saying they're discriminatory maybe you end up feeling that way and you were like, I'm not going to change my views. Like, that's how, who I am. Maybe they wanted you to give up. You know, God forbid. Like, you shouldn't change for someone. Anyways, the Five of Swords, the Five of Wands, the world, the Queen of Wands. Um, you're letting go of some drama situation uh, where, like, someone here, you were, like, into them because of something about their ex. Like, it was getting you. You were there for the, the I'm hearing for some of you for the clout. Why do I feel like we have so many cross watchers in this cancer read? <laughs> um... By the way, guys, yeah, let's hit the like button and get at least 144 likes before we get into the next sign here. Thank you so much for the like button. Justice. So, um, yeah, I feel like this was some, like, really tacky. Sorry, but like a Dr. Phil episode. This was really, really... I mean, this is probably one of the lowest vibrations you feel you ever hit, I'll be honest. Cancer. Um, you can't recognize. Like, if you look back on yourself, you're, you're like, I can't recognize myself. <laughs> five of swords, five of wands. The world, like, this was some drama. Yeah. You were, like, going off the hinge. It, it was a relationship that brought out like really the nasty and you maybe even like, yeah. Ace of pentacles. Okay. I'm here and I didn't like who I was becoming back there. We have the queen of wands. You kept trying to find maybe closure with someone as well. And then you come to realize, you know, we are not going to find closure in this connection. We just can't like this person for some of you possibly even was winding you up and you just realized that like this person just winding me the fuck up like we're not meant to find closure this is meant to be dramatic annoying it's like it, it, it gives south node karma big time like i feel someone here with that queen of wands was like taunting you to try and find closure but like no matter what you would do it would just yeah so i see you dropping that the expectations were just way too high. It could be a job, but I feel um, it's a relationship where, like, a group of people, you stop feeding into the marketing. 
the bullshit. I hear it like that. All right, let's get here. Who, uh, who are, you, who is coming in? Cancer. I feel like you have one more though cord you're cutting. Let's see. What is it? And of course, this is a general. This is also a general video. We have two of swords. This is possibly two people who were like, um, what's going on with these two people? They were like talking nonsense. I feel like you're gonna have to cut some people off here. These are people who didn't do. They did. They they, they are frauds. Okay, frauds. Um. It, yeah, they let they had left you hanging, waiting. Let's get into the next read of. Could even be like a manager who didn't promote you. Like it could be something you were investing in. It's like, well, I didn't reach this quota by now. It's like, what kind of marketing is this? They promise to market your craft. I don't know what that's about for everybody. But yeah. Something about house renovation. You may rehire who is handling that. But let's get into who's coming in, Cancer. Seven of Wands. Someone is very gentle. I see a gentle person here, which is interesting because the Seven of Wands is coming through other three cups. This could be someone who, ooh, they're very attractive to you. Yo, yo, mommy. <laughs> this is someone turning you on, Cancer. I see this person. Like, they're just your type. Like, they're not too overbearing. They're coming in in this very subtle heat. And they're reminding you. I see them just reminding you of the things that you really need to keep your mind on as well and that's turning you on like damn i like your energy like you putting me in the right kind of headspace the right kind of energy <sighs> you know you like how this person makes you feel grounded some of you this is like a physical trainer or something this is someone you're just really you may get more like friendly or even flirty with this person or i don't know now everybody i see you like enjoying this time that you guys spend together though like they make you happy they bring you up <laughs> You feel like this person has your best in mind. You may be working with this person and more develops from that point on. Um, you're working with this person. And wow. Yeah. This person, I see you guys fantasizing a lot about each other. There's a lot of hidden fantasy. This just flopped over and exposed the nine of wands up there. I Yeah, I see that um, you're going to want to like, reveal your crush on this person like it's gonna get to the point where you're like uh i'm not like just shy i don't just see you as a friend i want to like be with you because it's already like getting to the point where you're feeling this tension like in a friendly capacity and so um you're not shy like you want to see where this can go um can we get a little bit on the sun, moon, rising of whoever this is? Oh, yeah. I feel like this person, um, <laughs> they could be a little younger. They could be a fire sign. Leo Cancer, Aries. I'm hearing Aquarius. And we have strong Virgo. Anyways, uh, let's get into anyone else coming in. I see you have a Taurus coming in as well, Cancer. New contracts, the Five of Cups. You may have a client here. Ends up being a long-term client of yours. Something that's, that's going to last a long time. It could be a service you provide. I see you getting more. There's something that's happening more with that. Okay. And I feel like that's going to be part of your bread and butter craft. And that's going to be something that you may be known for in, in, the, yeah, in, in the global capacity. It may even be something you're working on with that night of wands. I'm seeing that night of wands mirroring that energy. So it could be a joint like business plus like, you know, relationship, crush, vibe. Okay. So yeah, some of you may be dating someone even, and then you weren't thinking of like marriage. Like you maybe were going in thinking, I'm not want to get married. Like no way. Uh, maybe you were, you have been married, but then you're starting to think like, maybe I do see something here. Let's get into the next sign. Leo, what signs have we done so far? Oh my God. Does that put pressure on? Oh man. I know. I tell people, Hey, if you don't want to be a moderator, it's fine. You tell me. <laughs> Cause then I realize, you know, maybe it puts pressure on people. <laughs> what if you just want to come and chill, you know? Anyways, thank you for your support. 
Ten of Cups upright. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Queen of Cups in reverse. What's going on? What sign are we on? Leo. Did we do Leo yet? Let's do Leo. I'm really happy to hear that, Alyssa. Okay. Leo. Something about Hewlett Packard. Something going to get rid of a printer you had for a long time. Too long, Leo. The time has come. All right, just saying. Oh, we're going to cut the cord on the printer. All right. So that's for some. But anyways, um, all right, Packer in there. Going to put in the original box. You still got the original box for that thing. You're going to send him away. I don't know. It's something like it's some kind of technology. Now, someone you're releasing, Ten of Cups. Like you had a lot of really fun times. Yeah, I feel this is like literally like an object. It's like something. It's even like a community like printer. I don't know why you're in charge of that, but I'm seeing something of, with a penny. Like you put pennies in the printer and you can print. I don't know what that means. Maybe you're going to stop going there. You're going to get your own damn printer, Leo. You're not going to have to go to Kinko's, FedEx. You're going to get your... I'm going to invest in a new printer. Okay, that's what I'm hearing. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe some of you extremely frugal. You don't want to buy a whole printer, you know, to just print some little shits. <laughs> like twice a year. I don't know why then it would be such a big deal. But I don't know. Maybe you were just even... It's a metaphor possibly offshoring something. You're having other people do it. You're going to do it yourself. You're going to like really invest in that. No, 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 no. I'm ready. I want to like have my own printer and my own thing. Maybe it's a meta for you guys. You take it as you want. So let's do it with your creativity. Also, you know, I feel like it's a matter of your investments. Maybe you've been really invested in something, but not in the way that you want it to be. Maybe you're renting. Now you want to start, yeah, actually owning your, your stuff. Like you don't want to just have something for some time and have it work for some time. You're not going to be doing the Amazon cheap, yeah, investments anymore. You want to have also like stuff that looks good, that feels good. Like you're getting rid of some tacky old technology junk that doesn't look good in your place. I don't know. I'm hearing it just like that though. You're going to sell it off. Some of you, you're going to just get rid of it. Um, So you just doing a prayer and just get getting rid of that the printer okay so like let's go further now with the ten of pentacles in reverse and the queen of cups in reverse and the king of cups upright you could have had that thing for 10 years this for some of you i feel like you're quite proud about whatever that is Okay, but then, yeah, it's like, the time has come. You need to get rid of that thing. I'm hearing that. Like, yeah, you're realizing. It's like some, yeah, I see like a hoarding energy even a little bit. Maybe you were holding on to it. Like, you weren't using it. It wasn't really doing much. Yeah, anyways. It could be nostalgic. Maybe, you know, you had that printer when you were dating someone. Oh, man, that's for someone. Okay, but anyways, let's get further. Okay, who, what are you letting go of? I just really want it to come out, though. Return to center, clear the throw chakra. Happy to be a stalker, Alyssa. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Queen of Swords. <laughs> Six of Pentacles. Eight of Swords. The spirit, maybe. Yeah, time. It's time, Alyssa. It's a... Yeah, you're not you don't have that idea for nothing. I think I should throw that printer out. <laughs> Anyways. There was a space, Leo, where people were doting on you. It made your ego feel good. But then you're realizing this is childish as hell. I don't I don't need this these compliments from these people. Maybe it was like your social media. You're going to get rid of that stupid shit. I don't know. I'm hearing that from you. You're like, you're saying it's stupid. It's like, I don't want, no, I don't need a Facebook. So people will do what? Hit me up and say hi. And like, I like your picture. I don't need that. It's like, you're not interested anymore in like something but the social media. Yeah, it was kind of fake. Like, then you had to check in every day. You had to respond. It's like, oh, hi, hi. It's like, you're, you're done with that. I don't want to have to let... It's like becoming responsibility. I'm here in... Yeah, no, thanks. I, I'm going to delete my account. I'm here in that. King Cups. Yeah, you're realizing you don't want to be that extroverted as well. Maybe you were very active on your social media. Then I see you just, like, starting to feel like you want to slow your pace down of life as well. Maybe you were, like, posting all the time. I'm here. I'm there. I'm at this club. Hit me up. Like, I see you wanting just privacy, honestly. Two of five of pentacles. 
Yeah. It's like you're not needing all this attention from all these people. I'm hearing that five of swords. Yeah, you're actually getting maybe even into like it's leading to some arguments. So you just need to just step back and just be in your own energy is what I'm hearing. Okay. Maybe it's a bit um of a controversy going on. Let's get further. Maybe you were like talking about your extremely personal business in like a public way oh that scared me i was like who's that <laughs> hi alex he's a scorpio maybe you feel it's like like social media is no fun anymore like now you got these trolls or you know you got big enough that yeah you got those trolls or you know your ex is following you you're like for real he's following he's looking at my stories you see his face on the list i'm hearing something about vietnam no i'm good thing i'm gonna delete this i didn't know he was watching that Ugh. maybe it's your family Maybe you like, yeah. So, anyways, hi, Bulbiter. Where were you? You were sleeping where? Oh. All right. So, what else, Leo? Yeah, you know, it just got it got too long of a night talking to all the ladies. Oh. <laughs> On social media, they saw I was like online, and I just couldn't do it anymore. I just couldn't. It's like, yeah, it's like the vibe of like you have to delete your OnlyFans. It's like you're getting too popular. They're keeping you, holding you up over time. I don't know, man. Let's just clear. Yeah, I'm just not into it anymore. I gotta, I gotta go, ladies. I gotta go. It's like you gotta say. It's like Elvis has to say bye to his, his fans and shit. He has to wave them down. Bye. It's like he's not really into it anymore. Sorry. Like, love and light, but... It's like, maybe... Yeah. Maybe... But tell him it was a nice ride. It's like, you're gonna a bit, like, graduate. You're gonna... <laughs> you're gonna graduate a bit from, like, this hunk... Hunk energy. Uh, I'm over being a hunk. I'm good. Yeah. It's, like, getting, like, kind of... It's repetitive. It's, like the same shit you always getting those same types of people commenting the same little emojis on your stories i don't know you know but it's also becoming a bit of like a obligation you feel like now you're obligated to respond to all these chicas i'm hearing that <laughs> but yeah i mean tell them in a nice way like i'm happy that they were here it sounds like you'd want to run away leo <laughs> But like I don't want to be rude and shit, but like I gotta delete this uh the social media account. It's like I gotta delete <laughs> I gotta delete, like I don't know how to say bye. It's like you gotta hang up on these people or something. I don't know how to do it though. Like uh okay, bye, bye guys. Yeah, it's a little awkward. Like it's like your fan club. It's like you were really into them fanning you and shit, and then you gotta just shut that shit down. I'm here in Til Tilbury. Like, they'd be, like, all over you. <laughs> By the way, guys, let's get at least 200 likes. Let's do this shit, Leo. We're gonna hit... We're gonna keep on the road with Leo's vibe. With Leo's messages until we get at least 200 likes. Let's hit that... They'll say the like button and get at least 200. In the meantime... We gotta figure out a way to delete this social media. I feel like you may have a few accounts, Leo. Yeah, maybe you feel like your people are creeping too far into your private business. It's like, gotta like, yeah, delete this. Shoot, and I have that one account over there, and then I got those people over there. Maybe you're starting to get quite popular. And it's like, you don't want people having a record of like what y'all were saying back in the day, if you know what I mean. Some of you maybe now, like, I don't know. It's like getting a little, little weird, a little sticky. Like you used to maybe talk one-on-one -on -one with some people. Anyways, now... I'm here. Are you from around here? Yeah, I'm from around here. Maybe you were in the chat room. Just return to center. Maybe your computer has a bug now. You're realizing you can't rely on these weird websites. Okay, let's get further, Leo. Who are you releasing? What contracts? The Queen of Cups. Ooh. So look, Leo, I'm gonna be honest here. I'm gonna be frank with you. You had someone here on the line, Wheel of Fortune. Mm. I don't feel this is set. I feel like you're still deciding on this with that wheel of fortune coming in. For some of you, you maybe met this person on a social media app with the queen of cups. 
there was a lot of drama with this person. I feel they could be a water sign for some of you. This person was really in love with you and you may have to just kind of shut it down. I hear like that. Maybe you have to decide how, when the details, the entourage you need to bring along to make that, you know, the story known. Like, I don't know. There's something a bit like of a presidential entry and exit kind of vibe. Like when it comes to this breakup or however, it's like an announcement. Like, you're not sure, like, you haven't made your decision yet, like, what's gonna go down with this person, but yeah, some of you, this person and you, like, it's slow down, and anyways, it's kind of just sitting there, so I don't see it going very far further. Let's see here further, though. Return to center again. I feel like you're still feeling that one out, but six of wands. Who's coming in? I'm here in Chester. Some of you, you're gonna, um, you're gonna be looking more at humor. I see humor being important for you, like, Maybe, for instance, like you are looking more for someone who can make you laugh versus this shadow Libra uh, energy, which is what I'm picking up on of like, I want like the more of the friends, the better, like more social media, the better, like even like shadow Gemini. But I am really getting like shadow Libra where, where you were encouraging that energy where people would just kind of even objectify you. I see you're like shutting people um, how do we say like out of those outlets? OK, where they can reach you in those types of ways. Like, I don't want that kind of attention. I'm hearing that. Maybe you had an account where you were showing your body off in different kinds of ways. So yeah, Ace of Wands. Let's get further. Six of Wands. You could have been getting some pretty weird attention at a certain point. That just was like the final cherry on top. Tower in reverse for you. Maybe you were literally getting personal with your followers. Um, so yeah, now um, I see you have different standards. Definitely. Um, this could be a standard. But some of you, I'm hearing something about role play. I see you are looking for like one person. I'm hearing, is anybody out there? What's that song by Usher? Loving this club in the very beginning where he's like, are you out there? Anyone there? Who who are you? Um, yeah. You're looking for more. You're in like your Scorpio era. You're in your... Some of you, you're getting into this um, more like, I see like a curt energy about you, Leo. Like you're getting even more sort of um, professional with certain aspects of your life. Like you're closing your doors a little bit. I see that. Okay. Maybe uh, you were just, I see something corporate even for some, like maybe you're going corporate. Things are changing. Like maybe you had used to just run your business mom and pop style. Um. I see you're serious, <clears throat> which is funny because we're saying something about humor, but I feel like you're saying like, you know, there's a time and a place for that. Like I need to be intentional with that. Maybe you were just also laughing. It's like the feeling I was laughing at everyone's jokes. It's like, actually, no, like certain jokes are funny. Certain jokes are not funny. It's, it could be a political thing. It could even be um, like you're pinpointing your, your audience, your niche audience, and you're, you're going to really try to appeal to that audience. You're not just kind of free for alling it. Um, that's very interesting. So I see you getting closer to a Scorpio. If there is a sign here, it's a Scorpio. I see. Um, and I see you just like, once you start interacting with this person, like your perspective changes, you want to be more intimate. You don't want all friends. It's like, I see you at a certain point just dying. I need like one real friend. Like who are all these? Like, it's like, they're starting, it's turning into like robo affection and you really can't, it's like, you're starting to eat. I almost like going to have a panic attack. I'm hearing something about a guitar. What's that song? Teardrops on my guitar. Something is getting, um, it's growing out of control. It's like a fungus of like fan fandom. You got too many fans. It's like driving you crazy. Maybe because you, you're too, you're too open to it, right? Um, I'm hearing Keith. So yeah, I see you're wanting to get more intimate with one person specifically. Maybe you're gonna go from single to yeah in a relationship, right? Possibly you're gonna go from single to you know, it's complicated. Like, whatever gets these people off of you. I don't know your back. Like, something is... Look at the Six of Cops. Maybe you're going to start just not necessarily... It's not when you're in a relationship, but even before then, you're going to start getting your mindset coached for that type of relationship space you want to be in. And maybe, for instance, like, I don't want to date one of my followers or my fans or, like, people who, are in, who find me via my social media and, like, my pictures of my body. I want I want people to find me because of my mind, and maybe you're going to start a platform where you're focused more on that rather than feet pics. I'm hearing that. <laughs> Some of you. <you're laughs> 
don't know. I swear, somebody had like an OnlyFans, and you're just gonna have to. I just don't. I see you just <laughs> shutting that account down. <laughs> but it's like you want to do it in the middle of the night. Like you don't want to cause too much, um, like anarchy. I don't know. Kind of feet picks those feet picks B. You know, but it's unpopular apparently. But you don't want like when you delete those pics, like you don't want people going crazy. So I don't know. Anyways, Ace of Pentacles world, like you're gonna shut that shit down in the middle of the night. Like, okay, that's it. You're not gonna give anybody a warning. You're just gonna take everything down. Nine of Cups and the Six of Cups. It's like making you uncomfortable. Like there, I feel like you're starting to realize maybe that that attention. I'm seeing something about a beach kamana is not the type that you're looking for. So let's get further. Five of Cups in reverse. It's like you're gonna disappear a little bit. From the side of the web. Now we have the Six of Cups, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Nine of Cups. So who's coming in? I'm here and show, show me your rock hard abs, Gerard. Yeah, you had like some kind of maybe like even like a sex show. Just look, return to center. Some kind of sex show. You were using a glow in the stick dildo on camera. I don't know. What? Leo. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, something was going on there. So, and I feel like you're realizing, first of all, that I just said that on YouTube. Second of all, that um, yeah, I I I I I, I, I don't know about that. I see you deleting old content, uh, temperance in reverse. You're deleting like the website itself. Maybe that's your industry. I don't know. Or you just don't want to give to that space. It's a collective thing. It's an ascension thing. I'm seeing plants growing. Okay. So, anyways, sun of source. Who who is coming in? Some of you may need some legal assistance here. You may need to like hire someone to like clean whatever this is up even like, yo, bro, like we need to like clean that up type of let's clean it up. Yeah, I don't know. Son of Sora's are right. This is someone who's going to it's a lawyer or a specialist. I'm here in farm pharma pharmaceutical pharmaceuticals. I don't know. Four cups in reverse. The daughter wands are right. Yeah. Something about an ex of yours. Someone is going to try to pay off an ex and not say nothing about what happened back here. Like, hey, you're going to delete those pictures off of your phone. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> it's like, what in the Gemini? Like, he sent you those pics. Like, he sent you the feet pics or the whatever, the glow and six dildo pics. And he's got to come through. Like, he's going to, he's going to pay you to not, like, he's going to pay you to delete those pics. It's like, hey, delete any of those pics you got of us. Like, yeah, together. Reach just let that you have of us together like talking about that maybe even i don't know i don't know the extent for everybody but maybe maybe it's yeah this is you like finally deleting your cookies your cash anyways um let's get into the next read something about someone's sister let's get into who else is coming in leo what else are you attracting by the way hit the like button let's get to at least 200 likes to get into the next sign scorpio is next Isaac, you gotta wait, Angel, please. Just let's clear. Please wait, Isaac, good boy. Daughter of Cups. Ace. Wait, Isaac, I'm working. So, there's a new creative project for you. Okay, I'm hearing something about soft porn. Maybe you were, like, filming stuff. I don't know, Leo. I'm gonna take it as you all gone, but... There's something you're getting into. I feel like it's going to be less risque and it's going to be more like, yeah, um, you're maybe, for instance, not going to be into hardcore porn. That's what I'm hearing. Like, literally, maybe you're going to be more or you're going to not want to have that kind of sex or you're going to want to be more loving and gentle and yeah, mature. I feel that with the daughter cups and the ace of swords and the five of wands, like you're getting out of that, like rambunctious teenager hormonal drive type of you know like bone 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 to bone uh obsessive content watching i don't know whoa okay you're gonna just take it as you well leo maybe you had an entity you know maybe you yeah maybe you had an uh, incubus succubus so now you're coming into like twin flame love father of cups mother of cups two of cups the three wands chariot oh this is your time this is your time to really be in a relationship if you have any time it's now and you're realizing like now I need to get into that headspace where it, it's not that I need to, it's I, I want that now. Like I'm over that. Like you had your bachelor era. I'm hearing that your bachelor phase, just let's clear. Some of you are looking for, you know, to have children. Um, 
some of you don't want to wear out, you know, on these karmics. Like you're realizing I need to like break up like with this with this world right here that I'm in where I'm like with karmic with karmic. <laughs> the karmic. It's like that's their name or something. <laughs> it's like I don't even know who these women are. I'm having sex with. Oh my god. It's like I need to just break up. Like it's an entity and the name is karmic. So you gotta detach from that. I feel and you're gonna you're getting ready, you're gear getting geared up for a deeper type of love okay yeah you know so that's very exciting i'm hearing send me a high love it's not even like send me it's like you're like i need to change i it's not send me i have to be receptive to that type of love because it's here you're realizing it was always there you're kind of like awakening here leo to something when it comes to love so you could be drawing in a younger water sign someone who's also in the well there, you are in your feminine around this person they could have a lot of taurus as well it could be um, someone that you really click with and you feel a strong connection to like emotionally, not just sexually. So yeah, that's what I'm seeing. Thank you for tuning in. Um, I see 173 likes. Do we want to get into the next sign of Scorpio? If so, please hit the like button. I'll sit and I'll wait until we get about 200 likes right there. Otherwise, yeah, I'm just going to take a break with my voice. Thank you guys for the reciprocity as well. <sighs>
Hey guys. We are 13 likes away. 14 likes away, is it? From getting into the sign of Scorpio. Please hit the like button. I'm going to give it like one more minute. We need 200 likes to get into the sign of Scorpio. Thank you guys for hitting the like button on this video. Hey, Sage. Hey, everybody. We need 10 more likes to get into the sign of Scorpio. Thank you guys for tuning in for hitting like button. Showing up to the portal, claiming it. You guys help this content get around further to other potential viewers, other people here who are possibly new to these messages. So yeah, you do play a karmic role there. Thank you guys so much for contributing. And also letting me know that you really resonate with this content. Hitting the like button is confirmation. I do go back and see, you know, which which reads were more popular via the likes. And so you make, again, a change with what kind of content we come back with every so often. Let's get into uh, Scorpio once we get eight more likes. We are eight likes away. Let's do this. Scorpio. Let's clear the heart chakra. Thank you, Andrea, for joining members. Four likes away. Four likes away. Give me a sec. We are one like away. Give me one quick sec. Messages are ready. Oh no. <laughs> well, feeling guided. I guess it's a good sign. Okay. It looks like you have a tear coming down right there. I boobies. Um, yeah, so I guess it's a good sign if this is who you're letting go of, right? Um I'm hearing PD won't commit Pablo, like somebody here. <laughs> Somebody here is not is not is not showing up the way you need them to show up. I'm here in Chick Fil A. It's like this is the fiftieth fiftieth date we've been on, and he won't elevate. He won't elevate from fast food with me. I heard that you need to unsubs. Yeah, I'm here and unsubscribe from his from his album. Is but like maybe you like certain things about him. Maybe he's kind of popular, but then it's like he only t he, we only eat fast food together. Okay, yeah, yeah. I don't know. Re oh, return to center. I'm talking about Miami, Florida. Could be a father of wands, ace of wands in reverse, the lovers in reverse. Yeah, this week it's been insane with the trolls. So we just put on members only chat. It <laughs> makes it easier. <laughs> Um, the other day we were getting fucking attacked. It was a historic troll, troll sash. Um, and uh, Sunshine of the Storm was in there. I think she was like the only troll. She was the only troll, <laughs> she was the only, uh, troll fighter, the troll ninja. And it was, they were, it was like back in the day with the flute magician. Anyways. So I just don't want to put like stress and there's, I could feel the troll energy there. It's all over this week. So anyways, the sun of pentacles make it easier. Empress in reverse, the ten of swords in reverse. So, uh, huh. Returns on earth. Some of you like, yeah, for us all, it was just getting distracting. Um, 
this person I'm hearing something about Huggies. Like this person here, you guys return. This man, you know, he was very childish. He could even have a, a younger child that he needs to take care of, but then he's acting like a child. Like you maybe fully even like thought that, you know, at a certain point you were talking to his son. I'm hearing that, but you were talking to him. Some of you, you kind of have a crush on his son. I'll be honest. Oh my God. What? <laughs> Some of you. Oh man. Scorpio. Uh, well, I'm hearing, listen, like, I don't know. Maybe his son had a crush on you something was going on something you realize i can't uh, like he's also not respectful to women there was something about his past as well like i see <clears throat> he wouldn't like talk about whatever this is he also wouldn't get an official divorce i'm seeing that and he also wouldn't be responsible with his children and that was really problematic for you you couldn't respect that i feel you're gonna release that yeah and um you're not here as a booty call okay He would hit you up just sparingly, like, booty for a minute. Hey, be gentle, Jade. Who, I feel like that's it. Who's coming in, Scorpio? Eight of Cups. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. The devil. <laughs> the lovers. <gasps> oh, my God. You have... The Son of Wands. Someone here, um, someone here, they want to be that person who comes back into your life and, you know, brings you back to where you had something back in the day and, but, you know, makes you feel good again. I don't know what he feels. Someone here wants to be your savior, even your hero. Like, he's like looking at you like, are she they it? want to come in and like you know raise you up like they're feeling very turned on by the thought that maybe they could like come back into your life and like y'all could have a new beginning this is definitely an x okay i am seeing capricorn gemini scorpio um some cancer some virgo libra a lot of cap. Scorp. I don't know if we said that already. Yeah? Uh, Aries. I'm here and they're in their freshman era. Hey guys, calm down. They're in this like freshman era. I don't know what that means. But yeah, he's like feeling like he wants to like come back in like nine shining armor style. He's coming in with a son of wands from that eight of cups and the devil. He he wants to like, he feels like going to be a turn on to you like to, to just reinvigorate this relationship with you. Like some of you, he was gone for a long time. He wants to come in, like turn the lights back on up in that, up in that home there that you guys had going together. Death, six of wands. He has some idea. I'm here in Remy, sixteen forty eight. You want like a what's up hello? It's like he wants to what's up hello you. <laughs> okay, so yeah, five of swords reverse could be a lot of Leo. He was um, maybe not ready. Some of you, he was not ready. Something was going on in the past. Yeah. He was, yeah. So that's what I'm seeing. This person wants to come back in. They want to be, they want to glide into the DM. I hear that. He's like trying to flirt it up. He feels like he's going to seduce you. That's what I'm hearing. He wants to seduce. He, he wants to come in and like turn you on. Uh, some of you, this man is very hairy. I'm just saying. He has like really, really a lot of facial hair, a lot of arm hair, body hair. I'm here on specifically arm hair, very thick and curly. Um, let's get further. Let's do. Who else is? Uh, let's see here a little bit more about this person. Some new rising spirit. Like I see this person feeling like he wants to you know, kind of with you, like, all right, I'm going to go in and get her, get her to, yeah, to wake, wake me up inside, uh, Evanescence, like, he feels he wants, he feels he's coming in to revive you, that's how I feel he feels it, at least, who is this person's spirit, I keep seeing the son of wands, yeah, he's kind of got, like, I don't want to say naivete, but, there's a naivete about him, but yeah, three cups, you could have been like, okay, so we're seeing Gemini, 
son of cops. You, yeah, you were very like light with this person in the past. It didn't really, it didn't really get to where it needed to. Asa wants. He feels kind of bad about that. Who the hell is that? You guys, hear that? Somebody had a really croaky voice talking over there. Okay, so this yeah, you guys, like, it never happened. Yeah, see, the son wants, like, he's very, he wants, it's like, he feels he can finally deliver to you. So that's what I'm getting. Um, thank you, Scorpio, for tuning in. <sighs> Anything else coming in for you? Any other new contracts? Oh, shit. Give me a heads up. Cars be popping. And the dance floors be locking. Okay. And, and the bottles be popping. Like, something is going on. Pop, lock, and drop it. Pop, lock, and drop it. Okay, Hermit, Scorpio. Did we just almost dry rate on live? Somebody here is from New York. Oh, it's giving me a headache, this. Second, I thought I had something in my teeth. Okay, let's just... Oh my god, this light is so bright. And I have this headache. Oh. This is a Virgo, possibly. This person, for some of you, is from Brooklyn, specifically from New York, Manhattan, Long Island, Queens. Maybe they take the train. Maybe they live in Queens. They live, yeah, and then they come into the city. They have a New York accent, I'm hearing that, or New Jersey or something. This person's a Virgo. They got a lot of Scorpio. Okay. You may flirt a bit with this person. We got the magician. Yeah. Okay. Uh, this per Isaac. Hey, Isaac. If you keep barking, I'm going to put you in the playpen, doll. Okay, sorry, guys. That was very loud, wasn't it? Oh, my God. here something about the number two and i feel like whoever this is i don't know what's with the snacking you guys but um i feel like you feel a bit raunchy about around whoever this is something about this person something about Trump and Hillary Clinton. Makes me think of, like, politician energy, right? Honestly. Maybe you got, like, a bit of, like, a... 
like a like a politics energy off of this person it's turning you off um i see like slick back grease back hair this person very quiet and a bit sketchy like they're not really openly wanting to flirt with you but like you feel they are flirting with you I don't really see this going very far. Unless you entertain it. Then I feel like this is going to become... This is South Node, I feel. Yeah, this is a test, actually. This contract is a test. They're appealing to your South Node energies. It's very controversial, this. And I feel like you know, it's like you feel kind of bad. It's like, I feel kind of bad being into him. I'm hearing that. Mm. Yeah. Excuse me. Unfortunately, some of you may work with this person, and then you may have to just uh, leave her. You just gotta. This is not. This is not in your future. Like, you may have to move, change, build building with businesses. Let's just clear it. This is really. Yeah, I'm hearing raunchy. Like, you just get an uck vibe at a certain point uh, when you're around this person. So, you may lay this person off. Maybe they're, like, into you. Anyways, they may not get along with their children. You gotta just cut this off for some. I got, like, cold feet energy. Like, you were feeling really hot. I'm hearing something about Harvard. But it's one of those feelings where it's like, wait, so why has... I'm, I'm sorry to say it like this, but in this scenario, it's a little bit like, I'm hearing Alexander, why by now is he not married? Like, you're realizing he, it, something got to be too good to be true. He's kind of quiet and a little sketchy. Anyways, I see you. Yeah. Yeah. Let's move in. Yeah. Mm -mm. So that's what I'm getting. What is spirit's advice? He's kind of like manipulative and pushy. You need to have really strong boundaries with this person because they may, yeah, see the Virgo. He may have like a shadow Scorpio side that you don't see, but you feel it. You need to trust your intuition. Don't even get involved to begin with if you can. Like, don't even second guess it. Let's get to the next sign of Pisces. What's released here in these next few years, Pisces, in terms of contracts? The Empress. Oh. This is a property, Pisces. I feel it's a place you used to live. Or a place like a studio. Somewhere that you had rented out. It could be your workspace. You're going to leave that place. We got Justice. Yeah, as a contract. Something was also just deteriorating. Alex! Stop it right now! Ridiculous. I need to get them the... I need to connect the monitor there so I don't have to scream because they're all the way in the other room. My god. Justice, a son. I need to just page him in. Paging Alexander. No barking, lord. Oh my god. <laughs> During the readings, doll. Okay, Empress, the son. It's just love and light. The hermit and rehome. Something about this place didn't feel right. Or there was something like, um, you know, I felt like you liked this place, but then something about it wasn't right. Some of you, this place started to get too small or there was like bugs or something was going on in this place. It was a, a location. 
maybe it, yeah, a place they were working out of. Like there was maybe even like too much just something was going on. Some of you have a paparazzi issue there, depending on your circumstances, right? But um, I yeah. How are you gonna get out of this? I'm just curious. Like, what's the point that yeah? I'm here and I can't take this anymore. Yeah, there was something not working. It could just be your schedule even. Like, I have to drive all the way over there. I love the studio unit, but it's just not practical for me. Like, I'm driving so far just to get to that, you know. So, three of cups. You may t talk to some people and get, like, another... Um, you'll get a second opinion on something. You'll get some sort of insight, feedback. Uh, somebody may, you know, tell you, hey, I'm living over here. I'm paying this much. I'm getting that much for, my, you know, you're just going to realize, wow, that I need to just get out of this place then, you know? Hmm. Interesting. Any other contracts, Pisces, that you'll be releasing? I'm here in Aquarius and Virgo. Let's see. Daughter of Cups. I'm here for some of you as well. It could be a car you weren't really very great mileage on by the way guys let's hit the like button let's get to at least 230 likes i miss isaac i want to get them out of the playpen now hmm okay what's going on daughter cups the son mother of cups okay this is something that you were trying to get someone else to do but they weren't doing it and i feel like you're just going to be like you know what you yeah you're responsible for that okay for the decision you're making, you're going to detach from the sense of, like, responsibility to this, you know, to this, even this project. Like, you were trying to get this person to just do something, and, and it was simple, and they wouldn't. And, and I feel like you're going to, you know, you yeah, you're going to, you're going to have to let go of the, of yeah, of the guy's hairline. I'm wearing that the father sword. Like, he's very convincing. Or they, it could be two people. Like, some of you, you were trying to find a way to get along with someone's family member, but it's just not working. Like, Y'all just are not getting along, like, okay, and that's what it is. And so you're not going to try anymore. Um, hi, Angel. <laughs> it's getting <laughs> it's getting awkward. Hi, Jade. Oh, oh, guys, be careful. Hi. <laughs> oh, my God. So, yeah. What? <laughs> what is it, Boober? Where's your, where's your toys? Go get your toys. Oh, careful, careful. Okay, I said. He's a booby. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's very talkative. It was funny. Like, the other day we came home and he literally, like, I heard him say, hello. He was talking. Hello. <laughs> I was like, whoa, he said Hello. <laughs> Oh, hey dolls, what y'all doing? I see that, for instance, you could have been dating somebody here, Pisces. Oh, and you know, this, um. Like, this person could have had, I'm even hearing an ex that they wanted you to get along with. And it was just too exhausting, this, you know? Like, too exhausting. Like, I, I you're just, uh, it's like you're trying so hard to, like, make small talk with this person. Um, yeah, maybe even, like, they wanted you, this could even be a client. It's just not working out. Like, they wanted you to, like... <sighs> resonate with their friend or something i don't know this sounds like even someone who wanted to set you up with somebody and that's uh, like you tried it's not resonating something like that how many of you know who this is by the way i'm here in elmo yeah it could be a child like you're trying to entertain this person like it's just too exhausting okay yeah daughter cups mother cups like maybe even someone wanted you they were putting on your well you guys have to get along talk more i feel like you're gonna step out of that i mean i can't take this bullshit i'm here now oh my god i see you were like wanting to say this for the longest and then you're finally gonna give this person like a piece of your mind like it's you it's your child you gotta do this i'm hearing that oh my god justice whoa this feels like um very specific so Guys, let's get to 250 likes before we get into the next sign. Just saying, 
Justice. So yeah, uh, what else about this person, Spirit? Can you please tell us? <sighs> Father of Pentacles. By the way, guys, let's get at least a thousand likes on the videos we want to see again on this channel. Like in general, um, I'm gonna go back and see the most popular videos. I'm gonna start uploading more to members. That'll be probably like heavier, more, more frequent content there. So what you still want to see on the general channel, please hit the like button on. And uh, yeah, we'll start getting more like mm -hmm, balance between members and the general channel. Probably going to be more though on the members. So yeah, just saying, um, I'm looking at at least a thousand likes per, per video for the ones that we won't phase out. All right. So the side by signs. If we get at least, you know, one one sign that's got a thousand likes on their monthly general or their mid month, then we'll we'll keep that. We'll keep doing that. And you know, otherwise we'll just have it to members and um all right, we'll 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 be downsizing what with you know the amount of content we'll be posting is on the general channel. So just saying you guys, you let me know what content you still want by reciprocating and hitting the like button. Daughter wants a mother of cups in the hermit. Hmm interesting okay yeah this person was really complicating your life pisces and it's like it's their child it's their responsibility i'm hearing meredith like this person was making you feel bad or guilty that they didn't have a good relationship with the child but it was like their problem it's like it's not my problem i hear that i'm hearing elmo you were trying to make it work for the longest time Hey, guys. It's like a haunted house in here. <laughs> what are these props they're setting up here? Oh, I'll stand here. I'll do this, okay? You stand there. When they walk through the maze, we'll be like this. <laughs> and then when they turn the bed, we'll be all like this. <laughs> all right. <laughs> they're rehearsing. <laughs> Halloween. Okay. Father wands, daughter wands. Anyways, it's like, this is damn silly. I see like Pisces. Listen. Oh, I'm hearing return to center you're gonna give this you're gonna return the key to this person this is your child this is your home this is your life this is her upbringing you have to deal with this okay i'm not i'm not her father i'm you're not maybe someone here wasn't as active with you maybe you know it's just not the type of person you need them to be when it comes to you know this project okay whatever it is i'm you're in i need to like heal like I, this doesn't let me heal maybe this person keep you wound up with the child some of you um it could be co-parenting, but there's something going on where this person, like, wants you to still be tied to them through the child and, like, wound up and, like, involved in all of this. And it's not letting you feel free, truly. Hey. Jade, what you doing? Isaac, are you okay, doll? Good boy. What's going on? So, um, I'm here in Remy 1648. Yeah. Maybe it's like, I can't listen to like my music. You're always around the children. I can't listen to my Remy 1648 song. Like I need to like have time to myself. Like you're always making these sacrifices. Like I'm not cursing because of the children. I'm not listening to, I'm watching these cartoons. Like so, some of you, you need to, I see you giving something back to someone and being like, okay, you need to, you need to handle that now. I'm here in Zuckerberg. Can we get um what else are you releasing, Pisces? Anything else? I'm seeing you closing a curtain. Yeah, chaos. Let's get into the next energy. I see you just having more boundaries, it can be. So maybe you used to be like kind of more open, you know, with your time, your energy, your assets, and then you're just gonna get more kind of like succinct with with how you're give um applying your 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 yourself you know uh your your gifts as well you know how do we say like uh how do we say and explain this what are they doing <laughs> um applying your even like your attention like for instance realizing like why am i spending my energy on these people who don't really give a shit like they're just here to just kind of just sit around who it's kind of like a teacher wanting really serious students i'm kind of seeing it like that so i see you getting more like particular let's get into the next sign uh no Pis pisces 
Hey! Hey! Okay, that's enough. Hey, that's enough. You guys, stop that. Jade, relax. Isaac, you guys calm down. Hey, if you get crazy, then you're going to go in the playpen again. So, yeah. Um, I'm here with Dimarkey. I don't know what that is, but yeah, Dimarkey. Yeah, so I just see you getting, kind of getting more pinned in. <laughs> yeah. Yo. <laughs> Alex had his belt on. <laughs> Sumo hot dog wrestling. So yeah, let's get that. <laughs> All right. Who's coming in for Pisces? Let's return to center. Yeah. I don't want to say you're like not as patient, but you're just getting clearer with yeah, your energy. Let's get into the next. Who's coming in for you, Pisces? I see a Taurus coming in for you. Could be Virgo. I see you getting social here. I see you having a social life. I see you having a very different social life from what you have right now. Like whatever you have right now, it's going to be very, very different. <laughs> hey, hey, guys, be careful. Be gentle. Oh my God, he's going for his dick. Hey guys. No, nah, he's he's try, try, trying to trying to chew on his leg. Okay. Oh my god, they did a frontal. Front front row tickets. Jade, his his harness is turning into a toga. <laughs> Jade. <laughs> oh, guys. Calm down, dolls. So, yeah. This person or this space is very swanky. I see something very like King Arthur. I don't know what that means, but I see someone. You're going to. This person is very like refined. They got it together. They're very together. Guys, calm down. You're shaking the whole recording set. The computer. Um, it's very swanky. I see you like in an upscale lounge, like with a drink and a, a little table. Like something here is very, I feel like it could be a general energy. Like you're going to be liking this energy. This is very refined. It kind of has like the so-called classy energy to it. I see, like, a jazz lounge or something like that. Interesting. All right. But, yeah, could be a Virgo. Could be a, yeah. It's like a dimly lit bar or something. All right. Let's get further. I see you talking to people. Could be, like, um, yeah. So, maybe it's the place that you're, you're just going to start working out of a different place. It can also be... You're going to focus more. You're going to bring more of a uh, Venusian energy as well wow. into that and a um, Virgo energy. So you could be going through a transit Pisces where you're just like bringing, bringing those energies to the fore as well. Like bringing those energies more out, like accentuating those aspects rather than let's say others. So if you are more like, I want to like hang out outside and like go to the gym, you want to be more in like a closed, quiet, like dark place. So let's get further. But I see that maybe um, as maybe even like you want to be more intimate. Okay. Let's get into who else is coming in Pisces. Seven of swords. Someone is crushing on you. This is a secret crush. We had the devil could be one of those. Like is spirit going to let them in? Eight of swords in reverse. The seven of pentacles. Yeah, someone here has had their eye on you. Okay, they want to like, they want to hit you up, Pisces. This is someone who is like, they're not. They've been like watching you. They want to shoot their shot, but like they are taking their time, just staring. They feel like y'all may be like a real good match. I'm seeing the emperor, the son of pentacles, but yeah, who is this person? It's gonna take them some time to come in. I'm here in Warren. 
Daughter of Swords in Reverse reminds me a little bit of that energy in the Scorpio at the very tail end where like it's a bit sketchy. Maybe you, I, I don't know, maybe you just need to take time to get to know this this person before you make a move or you need to kind of get to know more about what's going on here rather than just jumping into it. Maybe um, you need to just, first of all, know who this is and maybe you don't know them yet. Maybe you, um, it's like, yeah, you, yeah, it's going slow. It's, well, it's like, um, maybe this person, Hmm, this person maybe is sketching like they're sketching like maybe you need them to come up uh, forth more openly you need them to maybe be more kind of like open with you they may be like kind of sitting back in the club kind of energy like watching you strength here with the empress but they have to get brave and like shoot their shot so yeah i don't see it manifesting unless they do step forward in some way but, like, uh, some of you, they're very thirsty and they're very, like, sexually attracted to you. But I feel them, like, not really brave to, like, act on that. Like, they don't want to act on that. So maybe, they, you know, they're just kind of like, well, I'm Pisces high, you know. I just want to kind of stare at you. I don't know. That's weird a little bit. But, yeah. Senna wants, um, wh I mean, what's going down with this person? I mean, maybe they're even, like, stalking you. But they're not making a move. The Five of Swords. Some of you, they ha don't have a great reputation with other people. Let's go into the next sign. Let's go into the sign of Aquarius. We did Aquarius, right? No, we didn't do Aquarius. Oh, I did Aquarius on members. 48 hour series is uploading now. Actually, it's not because it got cut off. Um, I still have yet to upload. Okay, let's get into the next sign of though. I don't know what's going on with that Aquarius. Center. Well, let's get into Aquarius here. So the devil. Who are you releasing? Could be a Capricorn, a Cancer. Someone here was fucking annoying you. <laughs> okay. Oh my God. Listen, Aquarius. I see you fell. Like you were going to have a tower moment. And, you know, the level of trigger you could not explain. Like you felt that everything here was so designed to piss you off at a certain point. This person was triggering you. They, it's like when someone is laughing at something that's not funny and it's bothering you, bye-bye, okay? Even a, just a demonic energy. To start, yeah, the fool, they were like taunting you. Duh, I don't know what that is about, but they were like saying jokes, maybe even memeing you, bullying you, okay? Like being just sloppy, dis, you know, inconsiderate, disconnected, embarrassing, and just like overall just rude to the reality that you want to live in like you don't resonate and uh, but i feel it's beyond that like this person here was annoying you i'm hearing something trump i don't know what that's about but like this person had some bravado okay father wants ace of wands like uh, i don't know i i think that some of you you nearly got into a serious altercation with this person for some of you here you had to really tone it down and some of you it's like i feel you had to like wrangle with this person Okay, like you had to just have them sit down, like sit down, motherfucker. I'm hearing like that. You had to just, ha you know, and it was so impossible. I'm hearing that. Like they were so hard to meddle with. They were so rebellious. I'm hearing that. So damn stubborn. We just let's clear the energy. Like somebody they kept trying to be in your world, like, but without respecting the way that you said, like, if you're going to be in my world, like, you got to, yeah, I'm your, if you want to be my lover, you got to get with my friends. Like, he refused to get with your friends. Like, he keeps coming over. Duh, I don't know. It's like, hey, you're ready to get with my friends? It's like, no, no, I'm taking you over here with me to, my, to hang out with my friends. Yeah, so it's a maybe a metaphor. Like, he wasn't, he wasn't really serious about elevating, and he was wasting your time, and you had, you're going to have to get serious with whoever this is, okay? I just see him, like, hopping a, around, like, Trying to make his world like your world, okay? It's just chaos. I'm hearing something about Tumblr. Anyways, could it could it also be a, like an obsessive like stalker? Some of you, he was like looking at your social media posts and like hitting you up, kind of almost even like threatening you, like being overly like love bomberish, love bombing you to make you feel kind of like you can't move on it's like a little gross this yeah that's an understatement little is an under yeah major big understatement okay we got it let's get into who else what are you releasing like i feel like there's just nonsense like confusion like chaos all around you aquarius honestly like people just like not being their word around you as well nine of cups upright the moon in 
Son of Swords upright, the Seven of Pentacles upright, like something was a huge turnoff here. Some of you, you are very sexually turned on by someone that may have taken advantage of that. And then I see for some that um, they could have been two-faced. They could have, have been a catfish as well. Like literally like you met them on social media, you saw their picture, they showed up, they're totally looking to completely different. Um, you know, I don't know what that's about, but I'm seeing something like you saw a picture of their hand. It ends up being like that. Oh no, that was a picture of my foot. Like that's his foot. I don't know. Something's going on. Maybe it's, yeah. Like they're not, they weren't as decent as you thought they were. Like maybe you meet them in person and they're kind of like raunchy. I hear that. I don't know. Maybe you felt they were more distinguished coming off of like their social media. We turn to center. This is between the year 2023 and 2026. So yeah, like you maybe already moved through some of these portals. I'm um, here in chat. He could have talked really differently on social media. And then when you met in person, it's like, he's just like, honestly, like gross. I'm sorry to say it like that, but you were just like, oh, ew. <laughs> I do not want to hang out with this person here. Okay. Like some of you, it was literally a smell thing from a smell thing to, it was just sketchy. Like I'm literally seeing those shorts that we've been doing with the sketchy date thing. Like the sketchy date metaphors um, or whatever kind of content. Like you just can't see yourself with this person for sure. And I feel like, Finally, it's like when you finally meet them, maybe in person for the first, yeah. So some of you, they had a glazed look on their face. They were obviously doing drugs. They didn't tell you that like openly. Um, they came to the day like dreezed. I hear that. Anyways, now with the justice card as well, um, some of you, this person is also like causing you chaos and you're realizing that this is fucking chaos. And it's not love, it's chaos. And I'm just wanting to figure it out and bring calm to the chaos. And that's not my responsibility. I'm just going to drop this person's, yeah, time here. that they're, They've spent with me. Very nice. Thank you for coming. You know, I'm going to go. Okay. Yeah, doofy. <laughs> yeah, like, really, it's over. Yeah, um, thanks, though. Like, lovers and the theme, like, just kind of they're putting expectations, like, where they can never, like, fulfill those types of expectations. And so it's not for you. Let's get into who else you're releasing. Wait, Isaac, wait. Son of Cups, Six of Wands. Is this someone you worked with? I feel like it's ran its course. You had some creative times, but it was kind of like it didn't go further than where it went. Let's get into the next. Uh, who's coming in? Five of Pentacles. Okay. So I'm seeing something about bisexuality. Some of you, you maybe are experimenting with that. I do see two kings, so for some of you, it could be a same sex, two masculines, but you always take it as you will. You may have someone confess their love to you, Aquarius. It could be someone who is bisexual, or they identify as bisexual at least, and they are wondering if you are. They're not sure. They're gonna like shoot their shot with you though. Like, hey, like I have a crush on you. So just saying, like, you may get a confession from someone here who is. Uh, like we say, like they identify as bisexual and they want to like shoot their shot with you. Yeah, they could be a Scorpio rising or a Virgo rising or a Virgo sun, Scorpio sun. Some of you. Yeah. So they are very like sexually attracted to you. So we have the emperor and I feel like in general they are. They're very, very like their libido is like um, hiked up there more often than not like 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 yeah he's very very he's very very horny i'm just gonna say it just like that the daughter ones yeah the emperor so he doesn't know though like if you are feeling the same way i know right andre um some of you he's like really curious about yeah yeah he's he's gonna just shoot his shot Okay, so he's gonna do it. Some of you met this person on the subway. I don't know. I don't know where where the consistency comes in. Where that we could see, you know, how do we see? I mean, where? How do you make friends with somebody on the subway unless it's like really on the dot and y'all really meet on that exact same train every morning? But interesting. He sees you like every so often. He took note of your hair. Some of you, you may look a little bit like the Hanson brothers. You may have like maybe you look. He's not sure. Like he's not sure if you are into his like gender. Your hair, maybe you look kind of like in between. Like you don't, you have androgynous style. 
so he's not sure if maybe you have like interest in him like that but he's gonna i'm saying it again like shoot a shot he's gonna talk to you on the train you may have hair like this like bangs like like literally guys look up the hansen brothers that band yeah, Amir and hey, yeah, he, we just lost clear. I see a rainbow. He wants to like talk to you. He's he's gonna start getting more flirty. He's gonna start like holding the ad talk a little longer. He wants to see like if you're receptive. Amira, so does like she look away when I'm like looking at her in the eyes like that? He's gonna yeah yeah yeah. He wants to be romantic as well. I'm seeing that. I saw that with the Five of Pentacles a minute that came out. I felt romance. I felt romantic energy. Like someone here wants to also maybe take their time. Like they don't they want to yeah so. They, <laughs> they, um, like watching you. Like, I feel like they see you every day. Okay. They see you every day. So they've been, they've been seeing you pretty often. Like, They have been watching you. I just keep hearing that. So they know about, like, what you do for a living, even. Like, they know. Like, I feel like they've been, yeah. Just let's go. I see some kind of jewelry, earrings, necklace, bracelets. It's like rave bracelets. Rave jewelry. Um, The hermit. I'm hearing waterfalls. Like, he saw you. What is this about? He could have seen you. I feel like he thought maybe you were a showgirl or something. I don't know what this is about. Daughter cups in reverse, four of pentacles, a bright three of swords in reverse. He saw you with your children. I don't know, guys. He's maybe he's a she or they. They maybe know even about like they've been observing you on maybe on social media. He has access to your social media or something like that. Or he sees like he sees where you've been at and he sees that you He's seen you, like, in different phases. Like, maybe you're also interested in bisexuality at a certain point, but then... <clears throat> then you... <laughs> I mean, some of the FBI and coins. I don't know what's going on there, but uh, the higher font in reverse. Like, they... <laughs> they don't want to, like, come out to you about that. That they know that. Okay, so... I feel like a funny energy, though, with a four, four of cups. Like, they saw something of yours. Like, what? Hold on. It's itching like crazy. Yeah, wait. He, like, saw you. Or this person saw you. It was, it was in a moment where... I don't know. It's almost like I knew you when you were younger. Or I saw you, like... God, I don't know. This is a little bit interesting. Like, Daughter of Pentacles. Maybe he saw you. Like... It's like when someone sees you from the outside in. He surmised something about you. I keep hearing he. I'm hearing trek. Oh, that's quite a trek. Like, you gotta walk. You gotta really, like, walk far. Yeah. I see, like, you guys. You were rushing through something, but then... He was, there's something even like, it's just funny. I don't know. It's satirical or ironic. Like you were just standing there, like waiting for the bus. I don't know what that was about. And then he saw you from behind. It's like aloof. It's like you were a little bit maybe oblivious or out of it, but I don't feel there's like a way for you to know. I'm hearing something about a record. I don't, what is that energy? Hmm. I don't know for everybody, but yeah. Son of Swords. Maybe he feels like he has reason to believe that you are. It's something like that. Like, uh, it's like when the child doesn't think that like his parents know that he ate the slice of pizza in the fridge, but he did. And they saw him on the. Yeah, I don't know. So take it as you will. But let's get a little further. Just get a little bit further. I keep seeing jewelry. I just see you kind of like not. I don't know what that's about. Can we get a little bit further? 
I mean, I like pina coladas. It's like you were singing on stage and like someone was. I don't know. It's like, it's almost like you're unaware. I don't know, I don't know for everybody. What that was about, but yeah. Yeah, see? Like it's something maybe even like they saw, but they see that side of you, but like nobody else did. It's like you, let's say you work with this person and then they saw you at the bar cantina. Oh man. <laughs> they saw you hanging at the bar cantina. And like, yeah. Hmm. Like it's like when someone sees you, they, how do we say, oh my God, they see through you return to center. Let's go in the sacral. Let's clear it in the sacral. Someone here is even like a surgeon. I don't know. It's like, it's like, I'm hearing like the likes of the song. So you don't know you're beautiful. The way you light up my world like nobody else. Da, 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 you if your hair makes me overwhelmed. Or like beautiful soul, you know, Jesse McCartney. It's like, there's this energy of like, your stuff is flying out of your hands. Your books are falling out of your pockets. I mean, yeah. Who keeps books in the... I don't know. Maybe it's your phone book. I don't know. You're just like... You have like an aloofness about you. And I feel this person... Just less clear. You have this aloofness about you. But then they find you very attractive and they're hot. They, they are turned on by that. But they are not sure. Like... Yeah, see the five pentacles again. Like, I feel like this. they like died for you. It's like a bit like I'm feeling this romantic energy, like even like emo. We did mention handsome brother. It's like, oh my god, like I'm in love with like her, I'm here in her death stare. <laughs> maybe you know you're just not. It's like you're not maybe realizing this person's into you like that. I don't know, man. Okay. Damn, that really turns me on. It's like he's staring at you. Anyways, <laughs> yeah, but he's not sure if. There's something going on there. Like, it's funny, though. I don't know why it's fucking funny, but I'm seeing French fries. Like, he, it's ironic. Like, he's watching you run around, like, frazzled. Like, maybe even, like, looking for him or something. But then you're, I don't know. He's seeing you, and you're maybe you're not seeing. Do you see him? What the hell's going on with you, Aquarius? It's like that moment. It's like, she doesn't know I'm here. It's like, she just walked right by me. I'm right here. Hello. It's like, he's waving or something like that two wands like you guys may even bump into each other and then i feel like you didn't recognize him or something he found that very funny i don't know why this is so funny but some something yo maybe even yeah it's like he sees the other side to you like he saw you like he saw you like outside of your professional space and like he sees it's like he he sees what you don't see about you a little bit maybe even but I feel he's, like, watching. Oh, my God. I don't know, guys, for everybody. But, yeah, take it as you will. It's like, okay, there she is. She's walking into class, like, taking off her coat. Okay, he's, like, seeing you when you're not focused on him. Like, he's observing you. It's a little bit, like, a voyeuristic with the devil. <laughs> oh, my God. I really shouldn't, but I really oh my god i really want to tell her it's like what's going on i'm here in or orlando florida he's gonna fly he's gonna take a flight to you hey uh, i thought i'd just like hang out for a train because i'm one flight away <laughs> da -na -da -na -na. Da -da -na -na. the higher fun universe babe Ooh, come away. Oh my god. <laughs> What's with the wobble? <laughs> Wobbly. Wobbly vocals. <laughs> Teetering on the roll <laughs> the roller coaster path of this of what we call the song. I don't know. These jokes are wow, I love her. I'm hearing that. It's like this person really, I, I don't know. They 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 can't they but they find it fucking funny. I don't know why. Like they feel because they feel that you don't see it. I don't know. They think you're a little bit maybe nerdy and they like that. He's staring at you like, man, I love the way her her dress drops, I don't know, to her feet, to her knees, without her even, like, f you know, flinching a bit. I don't know, man, what? Okay, the what sign are we on again? Something about tuna fish. Now, the tennis stores reverse. Like, this person has, like, maybe observation of you in ways that you don't. Again, we're saying that. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
<sighs> Andre's like, I can't take, I can't, I can't take, I can't take it with this. The, 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 the aloof. I don't know what's going on with Carousel. I just need some karaoke right now. <laughs> I need a karaoke now. Maybe, uh, maybe one time we'll do that. Okay, but let's get focused now. Whoo! My ADD be off, off the train tracks. It's like I'm off the train track for her love. It's like he re he revealed something to you, but then he's laughing. I feel like he's chuckling. Like I see some dude on the train. He's looking at you, and then he's kind of like smiling to himself. Like what in the rom com is going on right now? He was watching you drop all your book bags or something like that, and like you had no idea he was standing right there. And I see he just like has this like little rom com smile. I don't know. <laughs> he just. <laughs> He's just like, I don't know. It's a very particular. It's like he's in a movie scene or something. It's like he's looking at you. He's something like that. Like he's touching his chin. I don't know. What's with this little rom-com vibe? But yeah. Like he's very rom-com, this man. Okay. Hold up. It's like you're like, oh my God, you're in a mess. Something about a swimsuit. You're like, yeah, doing what you're doing. And then it's like, he, it's like that is so clear. Some of you, he's got like, He's got a long chin. <laughs> His butt chin. For some of you, is a butt chin. You know, where it goes like a little bit like Shrek or like Zeus or whatever it is. So anyways, it's like I see he's looking at you, like looking at the side. Like, you know, he's having his whole hand on the pole. And then he sees you and he's like focused on you. And then you like move. And then he's just like, you know, something like that. That was it right there. Yeah, that one right there. That, that's a shot we take. We don't need no editing on that. Straight, straight to publishing. Lovers. That's that's his scene. That's gonna be in the in the trailer <laughs> for this movie. I'm hearing Taylor, Taylor Swift. The trailer, trailer. The Taylor is Taylor. I don't know. Don Don Juan. He's like maybe like a Don Juan, a <laughs> crimson Don Juan. <laughs> like yeah, he's kind of like he's very wrong. <laughs> It's so we keep getting the five pentacles. Like, is he a little emo? It's like he kind of like likes your emo vibe, maybe. It's like he's laughing. He thinks it's cute that you like drop your bags or something. This is like a fucking this is just this is the advertisement for the movie. Like, you're watching a totally different movie, and then this ad this is gonna pop up, and like <laughs> you're gonna something about children. Maybe he saw you with your children with the book bags. Yeah, you were like burp, 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 burp. like you're very into your energy. I see like you're on the train. <laughs> <laughs> maybe he saw you through the window you're just like with your kids <laughs> um he's like even lurking on purpose like he's hiding just let's clear return let's just clear it so maybe he's sitting with a bottle of wine like she doesn't know like how yeah how many children she's i don't know uh, how how she so, like i don't know man like it's it's that it's literally like yeah like when you're watching the trailer and it begins a little like yeah he's like watching her like a mess with her kids and then <laughs> and then he <laughs> and then he um i'm saying something about mangoes it's like but he's not helping her he's just watching her i feel like that's part of it like he was watching, I mean, some of the NBA, like he's just observing and he's enjoying and he's just like sitting back. Like she had something go down, like, and he's just laughing, like, like, cause his child, her child was like pulling her dress string out and she wasn't realizing something like, are there something going on? Is this on what we're releasing or what's coming in? The five of cups, what we're bringing in five of cups and 10. It's like, yeah damn that's so cute it's like he's just like it's like he's got this cup of wine in his hand gotta like say something it's like that what's that movie what's a i don't even know what is a crimson chin i'm gonna search that <laughs> um yeah that's a mighty fine example to draw from for the what i'm seeing yeah 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 so uh, yeah <laughs> like he's just fully sitting there so anyways like look even looks a little bit yeah he's got like yeah there's something he's maybe a jupiter rising like his features are very accentuated 
like his Adam's apple is very accentuated. Yeah, he's yeah, I Amir, mean, he could be brawny. He's a but yeah, like I repeat, he's silent, he's staring. He it's like as if you're a movie, he just wants to watch like what happens next. And then he falls in love. Star, that's it. So yeah, he's gonna shoot his shot with you. He wants to show up. He may like that you look kind of androgynous. I see him like laughing though a lot. I don't know, man. Yes. Oh my god. Something about that. Right, right. F fairly odd. Fairly odd parents. Yeah, fairly odd family, whatever that is. It's like something like a little bit like satirical or ironic, where like you guys are characters. Yeah, it does really uh, there's something about that show it reminds me of. Yeah. Let me look up the characters there. It's like it's got a little bit of that movie. Um what's that movie i personally wasn't really a huge fan of it oh my god this looks timmy turner looks like isaac okay anyways but yeah um i it gives off these vibes yeah he could even be kind of like i thought this said cocker like cocker spaniel so maybe you have a dog but Anyways, it's giving off. I'm hearing something about Spider Man. Some of you may have your first kiss. Remember that whole Spider Man thing? It was a pick a card. What's your first kiss with your divine counterpart going to be like? But yeah, um, yeah, I used to watch that show a lot. My sister will watch it and I watch it with her. But yeah, so um, what were you we saying? Like, yeah, that show with Matthew McConaughey and just Jennifer Lopez. What, what was the name of it? yeah and um i feel like you guys are very different and like his vibe is very different but like he likes that like he's going to work he's in a totally different energy like you're in a different energy and he's just like finds you very interesting so signs we're seeing here let's see there could be a, a i'm hearing a leo or a libra or a gemini and a sagittarius prominently in this connection you could be a water sign cancer sag i'm seeing a lot of sagittarius A lot. Uh, someone is definitely at least... I feel they're a Sag rising. Uh, we have the Mother of Pentacles. They have like a really big grin. Maybe literally, like literally. Like I see like a butt chin. So then we have here Wheel of Fortune, Three of Pentacles. Yeah, look, see, it's something pronounced about their chin. The Mother of Pentacles here. It could be really strong Taurus. But I'm seeing Sag. It could even be Sag Midhaven. Okay, Yeah. Their upper body specifically is very big, very broad. Um, but yeah, I am seeing really something about that fairly odd parent. Maybe it's something about that show. There's a metaphor there. Some of you, you may live together or near each other or in the same house, in the same building. You may be roommates. But yeah, I just see him smiling like on his way to and fro like throughout his day. So take it that again as you will. Four of Wands, Three of Pentacles, and the Ten of Pentacles. Maybe, yeah. I mean, hey, what's what's your number? Like, can I have your number? Like, this is so Hallmark right now. Like, he's just standing like in the hallway, like, hey, like I'm hearing a little music playing in the background. Like, it's a Hallmark movie music. You guys, this is extremely uh Rome. It's like classic romantic. It's like he's a Greek, you're a Roman. It's like something like that. It's like, hey, so like, can I take you out? It's like something like that. <laughs> I keep saying something about his chin. Somebody here definitely has children. Um, yeah, but he's been watching you. Like, he can see where you're like in that phase of your life. Like, I feel like he describes it as something very interesting. Like, he find he finds you very interesting. He he's telling his friends about you. Taurus, Capricorn, Aquarius. We see Gemini. We see strong Cancer. Uh, we're seeing some Leo. More Taurus. We're seeing Libra. A lot of Sagittarius. Okay. Anyways, you're very different. It's like, huh? What? Like what? It's like you're a little out of it, maybe. Like. What, what 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 it's like you're with your kids like you're looking around it's yeah it's like he stops you yeah i don't know it's just something very interesting I, I feel like the first time he's just staring at you but then after that like he's gonna stop you hey like i just have to say like yeah you look ravishing all right see you later it's like <laughs> this is so hallmark i swear <laughs> bye it's like you guys are just bye i'm here in kygo <laughs> interesting oh the hermit yeah some virgo or aries as well all right let's get into the next sign now any other contracts coming in aquarius let's see let's see mirroring these flies be buzzing around these boots were made for walking it's like but i got so many flies i gotta swim okay five pentacles reverse 
The Empress. Interesting. Could also be, oh, the Hierophant. Some of you going to move in with this person. Oh, my God. Okay, some of you are going to have a relationship. You're going to move in. Some of you, there's something about that. Okay, let's get into the next read. The next sign is Virgo. Let's jump in. What's up, Virgo? You feeling it? You're going to do this? 2023, 2026 interval? When it comes to contracts, we're leaving behind contract. Donezo. Bye-bye. And then new contracts coming in. Sounds like a big deal. I'm feeling some, ooh, some throw chakra pressure there. Okay, so what's what are you leaving behind, Virgo? I see, like, a lot of nostalgia here. I see a lot of, I'm sorry, like, I just can't do this. Like, I see a lot of, like, the hills, that scene where she's breaking up with Brody, and it's very emotional. Three of Pentacles, a death card. I'm hearing dental, dentist. Someone is maybe a dentist. There's just something, like, I'm hearing, I, there's something, like, you you can't, I'm here. yeah, return center. I'm hearing, you're gonna, I see you crying, like, bye. I, yeah, you can't, death card. You're gonna be moving away, maybe can't like live in this house anymore can't be at this place three of pentacles then we move into justice two of swords three of wands in reverse ace of swords of bright nine of swords in reverse something about bali yeah so something was um hmm i'm here in jump club the jump club not sure what that's about I thought we did Capricorn. Did we not? I feel like we did do Capricorn. Um, can anybody confirm for us? Anyways, but yeah. Um, Three of Pentacles are right. Death card are right. I don't know. I really don't remember. Does anybody remember? Did we do Cap? Now, the Five of Pentacles, the Death card, Three of Pentacles. I'm hearing some, somebody is a student. I'm hearing Gemini. Now, um, you may separate from someone here. Um, you may have to, like, yeah, I see you getting on, like, a bus or a tour van. Maybe you're going on tour. You're a rocker. You got to say bye to someone here. Could be a Scorpio here. Let's see here. What's going on? Son of Cups. Yeah, they're a water sign. Um, I feel like you may just like grow out of this connection. Like it's time for you to graduate kind of thing. I'm hearing something about cosmetics. Mother Cups. Yeah, it's like, bye. Like, bye. It's like quite emotional. I feel like it may be a broke up. Broke up. A breakup. Maybe someone here in a different language or a different country. Someone is a nail technician. You guys are moving. It's like, you just can't. Yeah. Hey, all aboard. It's like, okay, bye. Bye, Samson. Like, you have to separate. Let's get a little further. We have the hangman. I mean, we're in clearance. It's like, yeah. So some of you, like, you're moving away. I see a big van. Now, um... Yeah. So now, um, strong Taurus, I'm seeing Libra and I'm seeing Scorpio. Let's get into who else, what, what you may be. Yeah. It was a little bit awkward, maybe, um, that ending, but yeah, the magician, uh, huh. I see you moving countries, Virgo. Like I see you getting up, like, and just honestly leaving some of you, you maybe have to break a relationship off because of that. Is this Sagittarius? Is it Virgo? Okay, we're on Virgo right now. Yeah. So, we'll, okay, we'll do Sagittarius right next. Okay, but the magician right there. Interesting, you said Sagittarius. You maybe are a Virgo. I mean, you maybe you are a Sagittarius. But that could be a sink. Um, that could be a sink because the magician obviously is Virgo. And the three of wands, like, you have to really open your mind here. Some of you, you're not going to be in this comfort energy anymore. Like if you're with someone because you were in a comfort zone, you have some, you got to like grow out of that shell. And like, maybe you knew this person 
for a long time and you're growing out of it with the three of wands in reverse, the ace of cups in reverse and a cups in reverse. I feel this goes hand in hand with the last message. Like whoever this is, you know, yeah, you have to move on. I'm hearing, I don't want to be a burden to you. You guys, um, I don't want to be a burden. Maybe someone will hold themselves back. Like they're realizing maybe you're going off to college or like they don't want to like hold you back in a relationship. They also maybe see that you're going to be on the, on the road a lot you guys need like space virgo moment <laughs> so um that's okay though that's a sink so um oh weird okay so yeah, but anyways, some of you, yeah, like you're just going to be in another country. I'm here in Zoolander. You're going to be living in another country. It's like you can't be in a long distance relationship. Maybe some of you, like you're just going to decide like that you can't be in a long distance relationship anymore or that this is just not going to work for you. Long distance won't work for you. Um, and you're moving away. I'm hearing that. Yeah. And I do see cross country. So Yeah. Andre is, oh, John, I feel Andre was definitely onto something there. Let's see the emperor, three of pentacles. Like you're now in this energy of like needing to, yeah. Oh yeah. You need to spread your wings. Listen, the fool, the magician, the three of wands, like you need to spread your wings and really just, and I feel like it's like, it's kind of hard, but you need to do it with the sun. It's like, you're going to give everything away, give everything up and you're going to just, Yeah. You're going to get rid of your apartment. I hear that. The Eight of Wands are bright. Get rid of all your stuff. Yeah. So. And it may be a mystery where you head to. Like, maybe no one knows. Like, nobody really knows. So. It's a little bit of, like, an open-ended leave. Maybe you even leave a company behind. But, yeah, that's what I'm seeing. Let's get into, um, like, maybe, for instance, even, like, there's something about your lifestyle that you have to change. And you know that. You need to do that. So some of you, you maybe adopted a cat and you can't take care of it anymore. I'm just seeing that. Um, I mean, you're in Raven. That's so Raven. Maybe you felt like you were really in like that's so Raven kind of energy. And then now you need to get, you feeling you need to just like, yeah, it's like one of those moments where you need to just, get up and get out of there kind of thing like for your own sanity even okay maybe the environment reminds you a lot of um your past and maybe something here moved through that you just yeah it's i'm um, here in marley hmm i'm mean, here in i made my bed yeah something got boring like you were doing too much of it so that three of wands lets Gemini energy. And with that Sagittarius magician energy, like you have to really hit a height here. Like really, really like with your, I'm even hearing like your so-called superstitions. Like you just have this feeling, this gut feeling, like some of you may leave behind a whole life, a whole business, you know? And you know, like in some ways it's kind of like crazy, but like you got to do this for your sanity. I keep hearing that. Maybe you have a lot of Sagittarius in your chart. You could be a Virgo, but you could have a lot of Sagittarius. And you're realizing I need to fulfill that part of me. If I don't, like I'm going to be stagnant. I'm going to be bored. I'm going to be mind, <clears throat> mind numb. Okay, throw shock, right? Yeah, like some of you, I feel like you had a really, your job or whatever that was, that it was getting stagnating. Okay, so yeah, you're going to have to step out now. Some of you, you may retire from like your old, um, space that you were working in, maybe a business or a company, you were in politics, something like that for some, and then you're gonna just be like, I gotta like go sail the world. That's it. Like you're gonna do that crazy ass thing that you wanted to do. That's what I'm seeing. Okay, yeah. Like if you always wanted to sail the world, you're gonna do it this, the, in these few years. Let's move into now what's coming in. Oh, something about a um, a restaurant yeah. with the sun. the sun <sighs> you may even like go and do that entrepreneurial thing you always wanted to do like it reminds me of before i came to dc i really wanted to go to greece and like live in that cave <laughs> remember that whole yeah and so it just never happened um but yeah it kind of makes me think of that like 
to go and like do that thing, you know, that you always wanted to do. Now, the sun in reverse. To do that thing also maybe with someone very particular. So maybe you want to give more time to someone particular. So yeah. Let's get further here. The sun in reverse. I'm here in same, same sex. Okay, so maybe it also is something here for you. Maybe there's a place you want to explore. Maybe you're in like a stuffy, I'm here in Newsweek type of environment. I don't know what that's about, but um, yeah. I keep getting something with politics. <laughs> um. <laughs> I'm so happy to hear that. I'm not going to lie. Listen. I'm hearing some of the Amazon. Okay, so we're still channeling apparently. Okay, so was like, and we are gonna focus. <laughs> Mother of Zord, the sun in reverse. But yeah, um, some of you here, you're gonna go somewhere like crazy. You, some of you, like for instance, you want to go to like that rave city, that city where. You know, it's like maybe like it's like a like a it's like a well known like gay zone. I'm hearing like that. Like it's a very politically how do we say it? like it's very open to that. I'm hearing somewhere like Amsterdam or somewhere where they're very inviting to and they're very tolerant of different ways of life. These types of things. Maybe you're like that's it. I want to go live in like yeah wherever that is. Or you know I want to go to Paris where people you know kiss in the streets, you know, maybe you used to live somewhere more conservative, just, yeah, or somewhere like that. I don't know. Some of you Dubai, who somebody farted. Let's return to center. <laughs> Let's clear it. Let's clear that. Run and clear that, clear that. Home, 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 boy. Maybe you move out of your, your family home, family house. Yeah, so some of you here, like, you just gotta honestly just some, <laughs> you know, you gotta just get out of that you've been too much maybe at the house maybe even like a housewife type for too many years like you're ready to just explore now okay so some of you may honestly get a divorce you know for some and then anyways but yeah some i see you going into the single era the singlehood era and you want to just explore that and see where that goes so but let's get further uh what were we saying what sign are we on? Virgo, right? <laughs> um, I don't, know, I don't know what kind of potions these wizards be downing, but okay. Anyways, the daughter wands, the four wands, the mother of swords. So this is I'm here on tick tock, tick tock. What's that song? Oh my god. It's an old, older song. I mean, we're in Italiano. Like, yeah, I almost see like an eat, pray, love moment coming for you, Virgo. It's like, that's it. I want to go like to the Amalfi Coast and like do something crazy. I don't know. You want to go and like buy property in Italy and Tuscany, start a farm, do something, do something. Yeah, just out, just crazy. Like, that's your era right now. I keep hearing that. I mean, you're in El Elaine. Eileen, you want to like ride and do have a road trip with yeah so there's something going on with the mother of swords the sun in reverse daughter wands in reverse four wands are bright like you're really gonna maybe even like something with your house your living situation you may put it up for sale or you're gonna do something different with that you may go on a break a hiatus some of you want to go to japan you want to go some of you something about kuwait coming up I see something about Korea. I see something about Italy. Some of you, you're like, that's it. Yeah, you're going to maybe even like leave your husband at the house. He's going to take care of the kids. You're going to go on a solo, private, like entourage trip. I don't know what that's about, but <laughs> yeah, I see that. It's like even like a cruise or something. You're, I just see you being like, I need this for myself. Eight of Wands. And nobody knows it but me. Like, you're just like, I don't know where I'm going to go. I just, yeah, bye-bye. Like, you're going to just, like we said it, you know, what you're letting go of, like, you're just going to, hmm. It, 
it's like, where are you going, honey? I don't know. I don't know. I hear that. And I feel like it's true. Like, I feel like, but I do feel like you do have an idea. Some of you, you're just changing the pace with your life. You just want to live somewhere for a period of time where you can just, you know, there's something that you're looking for more for in your life. And I, I feel for some of you, you know, you're trying to find yourself so-called the father of pentacles. Yeah. I mean, who is this though? It could be a general energy that you're just not really like looking at anymore the way you were. Like, I'm just not really like, like focused on that. I mean, or, yeah, it could be a quick or someone you were very hung up on. Like, it's like, yeah, the hook dropped and I, I'm not going to like reinstall it. I got to go. <laughs> As you leave in like, it could be a yeah a property behind like you're gonna re you're well how do we say you're not gonna want to live there anymore and you're gonna want to um hey I was thinking about you divine you're gonna want to I see like a kiss Valentine's Day chocolate candy you're you're gonna want to just travel you know and for some of you or or you've been traveling and there's somewhere you want to really like explore though I'm hearing Prague it's a city like I feel like you're very yeah you're very focused on that and I feel like you're not really hmm you're very curious so. Anyways, could be same sex, father of swords, father of swords, what? Father of swords, father of pentacles. But it could be two father of swords, and maybe woo you're leaving behind is a father of pentacles. I'm hearing woo. Hmm. He can't woo you anymore the way he did. Like, you may take a pause from that. I'm, I mean, this for some of you may be, you may be ma you know, married, okay? And then you're like, hmm. You're maybe exploring same sex, okay? That's for somebody, maybe. I don't know. You're going to take that as you will. Return. So let's see what, what uh, is here now. The King of Pentacles. Yeah, really strong Capricorn. But I feel who you're. Uh, you're. This is air energy. Okay. This is air energy. This is Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy. So you may be traveling to a city that has a very Gemini, Aquarius, or a Libra energy to it. It could be intellectual, open-minded. Like if you used to live in like some, you know, tumbleweed town, you know, and you, there are a lot of conservative people live in there and you felt you couldn't really click with anyone then you I, I feel like you're going to be moving out of that place of that space so let's get it yeah i'm here at tumbleweed something about kansas like if yeah it's like dorothy is she's on the olympic road basically and i feel like they're not going to have like much access to you or at least like the energies that used to be in in your field are not in your aura are not going to really be as up in your energy. Okay. You guys, please hit the like button. Let me know if you are resonating with this content and it really does help this channel. Let's get to at least 300 likes. And we're going to get into the next sign of Capricorn of Sagittarius. So yeah, I see you exploring. Like, I just don't know where I'm going, but I'm out of here. <laughs> it's like, gonna, um, I don't know where I'm going. I'm just going to get out of here. You maybe were living in like the somewhere in the deep South or somewhere that just wasn't, it was like a small town and you're going to go to New York or something like that. Some of you, it's Europe, depending some of you, if you're going to stay in the States, I see you going to a major metropolitan city. I'm hearing even somewhere like it's all relative. I'm here in Minneapolis, twin cities. I'm hearing Chicago for some, I'm hearing somewhere about Edmonton, Canada, Alberta, Canada. You're going to go to like a, one of these big cities. Um, Tokyo, you know, it's like, you're not, you don't want to be in this little, like everybody knows everybody kind of town. So let's get into the next. Yeah. You don't want to be where, um, there's so much infiltration of everyone's ideas. Like you want to be able to be in a space where you kind of have your space to be who you are. If that makes sense. Like, not like, oh yeah, everyone here grew up here. And like, you know, we're all like in this family dynamic i don't know how to say that before nicely but you know it's just too much of like we're all the same person almost like we're all it's 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 two of this like shadow taurus even it where where you know it's kind of like a um he, he like a, how do we say um yeah kind of um it's like a hierarchical energy. You're not about it. Ace of Cups. You want to be somewhere free flowing, fun loving, the chair with the Ace of Cups. You're trying to understand like what that is, where that is. Um with who that is and you're realizing i need to change my environment some of you are going to go to a coastal beach town some of you it's hawaii okay i see something just different i'm seeing a bar like you're gonna try you're just gonna try and it's like okay like i just want to see what happens some of you you know you're really needing that maybe you're yeah clear. you may have children you may have a husband some of you you may be uh you have a wife you know depending i don't know for everybody okay like, 
you may have a they, whatever it is, like you just need to um, try something. It's like, hold on a second, like you shape shift. So let's get into the next energy. Let's get here. What else is coming in for the sign of Virgo? Sun of Swords. And I feel like you're not looking back. You're not like recontemplating that. It's almost like this urge. It's like you just kind of like run away almost. It's like an escape. And I feel like everybody, maybe you're the first one in your family to do such a thing. Like everyone here, they, they be naming those tumbleweeds, you know? That's John, that's Richter, that's Paul. It's like you can tell who everybody is here, but like you're realizing that's not my life. And like you have to break away from that energy. We have the son of pentacles. That's a son of a son of sorry. It's a bit like claustrophobic. Let's return to center of the heart chakra. I love and light to all. Yeah, I'm not making fun of nothing here, but yeah. Some of the kindest people, you know, that usually do come from the south. So it's not about but I feel for you, you're just like, I need to, I know I need something different. My heart is yearning for some change. Now the Son of Swords, you want more dynamic energy, Son of Pentacles. I'm here in electricity. Some of you, you're looking for a place on the grid that can speak to your um, your starseed needs. Okay, that's for some of you. You're really thinking about that. Like, I need to be around people who are woke. Some of you, you're feeling that way. Okay, sometimes it's not always that spirit has you around people who um, are awakened. You know, sometimes your yeah, your grid, your light work, it it entails you to be in spaces that need awakening, that need your energy signature there, um, and maybe left behind. You'll maybe eventually move, but right now, yeah, like some sometimes, right? That's how we're, we need you here for now. But some of you, you're re realizing now is the time for me. To, yeah, now I now I've been here enough, like, and I'm ready. Uh, yeah, like you're realizing I have moved through that chapter. So let's see here. There's someone of a, there's an opportunity for growth in your career. This is coming. And I feel that might be a simulated pathway for you for this other more macro change. Like, Hey, like you want to work out of our office in this country? Yeah. It's like, you're going to do it. Uh, I'm here in chlorine betaine, betaine, something about biology. Maybe you're a chemist. Like you're going to, I'm telling you, like, if you could do exactly what you're doing in another country, you're going to do it. I'm here in Amsterdam. All right. Um, let's get into the next read. For the sign of oh we're 10 likes away let's get at least 300 likes guys thank you so much for hitting the like button it really does help this channel and this content expand further thank you so much for your support okay we're getting into the sign of sagittarius i'm gonna just hold off until i see 300 likes and we'll jump in Jade is a Sagittarius. I believe. He's a good boy. All right. Four likes. Let's get it. Four likes, Sagittarius. Your messages are coming in. Return to sender. Let's clear the energy. Two more likes. And we will jump in or it. Gonna run this portal, Sag. I'm starting to forget like which one is a filter and which one is for real. Like the, I've been using that filter like for so long. Okay, anyways, uh, for so many times now. <laughs> 
Anyways, um, so we hit 300. You guys, thank you so much for tuning in. This is the sign of Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, Midhaven. Yeah, which one is your favorite? Go check out the shorts, you guys, by the way, if you feel guided. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't say that because, y'all, you know, we just hit 83,000 followers. So, hey, all right. <laughs> I want to sit there for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to yeah, we'll go right back down to 82. No heck, we may go back to 81. It's some weird shit over there, but we're doing it. <laughs> it's for fun. Um, but it is also channeled. So yeah, take it as you will if you feel guided. So um, there's a separate playlist for that uh, content, um, shorts. And I made a new playlist specifically for the Shrek content, the Shrek series. I think it's called KCAL Shrek. <laughs> <laughs> and um uh, there's one for like the dates and whatnot so all right let's do this you guys i'm here in apple apple bottom shorts shorts boots with the fur <laughs> okay i can't we gotta <laughs> all right so sagittarius let's clear the energy return to sender thank you guys so much for tuning in i love you guys so much you guys are so present okay and your guides want you to know that wow Sagittarius, your guys are coming in for you they really want you to know something here let's just set the read to the side we are with you on this okay your guys want you to know that you have really what it takes to get to the next level in your journey some of you here your guys just want to tell you right now that what you're passing through is a humongous portal and that you have been at the threshold of it you have been pulling others through this portal you need to be proud of yourself that's just all they need you to be right now is just proud of yourself and nothing more nothing less just right there be present in that energy and sit with that with the world here you know you have really come a long way many of you here what you're leaving behind okay is what you're sitting with okay and allowing to transmute into what you create there is this sort of natural okay translation of your craft and um you know i don't see harsh angles in this ending i see you sort of understanding that this is where i now you know sort of um need to be at you know one with the moment of and this is um yeah i'm hearing present in in in, in knowing i have created um so much around okay it's not about sort of overly identifying with something and then feeling, let's say, that you have now lost that thing. There's something here, again, that I'll say is very subtle, very neutral about this transition. So um, th this translation, I feel like you're very humble, Sagittarius. Like, you don't see how far you've come. Uh, you you do know, but you don't see, okay? And that's very interesting. It's almost like I see kind of like someone who, I'm hearing Picasso, Pablo Picasso, Um anything but Petey, right? <laughs> okay, but no, for that, go check out the Shrek shorts. But yeah, um... I feel like Sagittarius, it's kind of like you're helping people in spaces that you can't quite show yourself your own way through. Does that make sense? Like there's this humbleness, like, you know, you don't quite see who you are to others. I hear like that, you know, but you are that person and that's because you're focused on being that person. You're not sitting here, you know, for clout, chasing clout. You're not doing what you're doing. Also, I see for the fame, for the money. Some of you here though, that is, um, that is something that spirit wants you to open up to more. That is, that is not, um, in, in, in a way of like saying that, you know, you've arrived. Okay. And like, Hey, like stop and, you know, smell the roses. Um, they're expensive, but you know, this is something that, um, you know, you really have healed. Okay. Your mindset around, and they want you to, to, to know that you can, okay. Open those doors. Okay. Even further wider. Some of you, this has to do with how you are going to translate how you are, who you are to others and, and, and then to yourself back. So now you're going to be coming into this era of like, okay, how do I be who I am to others, to myself as well? I see a reciprocity for you. I see you in a very high vibrational energy, Sagittarius. You have worked so hard, so very hard. Your guides, you have worked so very hard. They want you to, they want you to, I hear it again, sit in that with the empress in reverse you know there's been a lot that you have moved through okay you've been moving through there's been a lot that has been held as sort of a mysterious illusory um final uh you know conversation that you have maybe even with a very particular person okay there's something that's been on hold it's almost like you know, you're sitting and, and you're just waiting for the sales rep to go back into the office and bring you what you, what you put on hold. It's something like that. And you know, like I have this pending, okay, traction in my, either my career or, you know, what it is that I feel I'm going to lead myself to the heights of in terms of more macro interests of mine that's coming. Okay. And those things that you also going to bear as fruit from these, 
these energies you've invested into your life to this point are um, coming, but they are going to be where you sit in this, in this moment. I hear it just like that. So sitting with what you've created and being kind of like in that energy of saying, well, I don't have to see it as anything particular. Maybe some of you feeling pressured to sort of understand what this is now. Like it doesn't matter. I hear like that. Okay. Um, that's really where, you know, you, you, you let, um, you let people go. I hear that as well. So maybe, you know, the people you need to let go of, like, is about sitting in the present moment. And so, yeah, you'll, you'll see, you'll see very, very quickly who is really there for you and who is not. And that's where spirit also is weeding out. Spirit wants you to know that much of the translate return to center. I see some dark energy here. Much of, you've had a lot of energy here on you, on your system, Sagittarius. Um, but yeah, um, you, what much of what you're moving through is alongside the collective. I'm hearing Joe, Joey, let's clear. Yeah. There's even a family member that I see spirit wants you to clear out, but the way that we need to realize what our traction is like ge genuinely, not just like, I'm going to do more of what I've been doing. It's been working, but like where we innovate our talent at, that is going to be where you sit in the moment of, of where you've been at. And, and you say, okay, now, 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 now is, now is not what it's why. And I, I, I now know my cause. Okay. So that's where, um, some of you here, you let go of needing to interpret what, what's going on. Some of you here, you need to let go of people who don't have that interest for you to, and to innovate again, yet again, some people, let's say like this, like they're just not there for the right reasons with you. Um, you have, so much though going on that it's not up to you to be like, I'm letting you go. I'm letting you go. You know, these are many, 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 many a soul contracts. These are many a soul contracts that let's return a sender. Whoa, let's clear. Up. Yeah. So when you see the thing about this piece with the world energy in reverse is you're neither here nor there. You're saying it doesn't matter to me. I'm not partial to it. This change is not of my ego's movement. Okay. Left or right, up or down. Like I am just here. And so that's where, you know, you're going to trigger the hell you, you're going to, you are going to combust karmic energy, um, that was in your auric field. It's literally going to just go like, you cannot, you just cannot make those changes in your life. Should you try to tackle them head on with the egoic sort of, um, persecutionary attention, um, or, or sort of, um, fixation. Like you cannot, you, it's about your elevation by releasing and in the true sense of it. Okay. Your connection to those people. So, and because those people are narcissistic, many of these people here who you have had in your life, Sagittarius have been narcissistic and that's well known. Um, but the point here in that, why you have, let's say, crossed paths with these such individuals. And I see it as sort of hand gliders on your auric field. Okay. People who would love to be a part of the portal that you're making a reality for many, many a people here, Th these people, um, yeah, they, they, they are, they don't have the endurance to, to, to live a life of, of love and light. And so, you know, spirit has brought them your way to make it more apparent to them where that distinction lies. And if they, yeah, if they are not able to make that decision to ascend, you know, it's not your problem and it's their karma ultimately. So just know that you've sort of been like a teacher, you've been assigned to these students and not everybody's going to pass Sagittarius. So right now we're doing this sort of sifting, clearing, we're feet, we're filtering out. I'm hearing your feed, your followers. I'm seeing a hundred thousand. I'm seeing the number at 100,000. Some of you here, this is about making sure that, yeah. Oh my God. Listen. Okay. So your finances, I'm hearing Penelope. I'm hearing Penelope, like it's like a pin, like when you put your pin in, you are going to be, oh my God. Okay. The heart front of the devil, like, um, ace of pentacles, your, your tier is unknown. This is uncharted territory type of vibes. I'm here in the heartland. You don't know. Your followers don't know. Your guides don't even really know how far this star will will have will have been been observed to to shoot. I mean, we're in more of your story for it. Like you are a geyser right now, Sagittarius. Like your guides literally are just like 
holding their breath watching you. It really is not something that you can really say much to as well. Like you don't know. It's like when you don't realize, like you have no idea. Like I see you about to win the astral lottery, Sagittarius, and it's just a matter of like, ching, 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 how high is it going? Like I see you winning like something even like in a arcade, like literally, like mm -hmm, return to center. You're putting money into the machine. It's like ching, ching, ching. It's like we don't know when it's gonna stop. Something like that. And I see you going, wow, very far. Devil with the heart font. It's like what? Like oh my god, what happened here? Some gonna go from rags to riches holy shit oh the ten of swords you are going to make your shit's gonna make headlines sagittarius you know it's gonna be very funny very it's gonna be ironic as fuck because these people back here with the, i'm seeing that three of swords here you were dealing with some petty ass shit but see that's where it's it's not for the sake of like well, okay that's it i gotta tell them i'm over it it's like the test is on you not giving a fuck anymore letting the sludge slide down the nickelodeon screen we're not really here for like give and take tit for tat Rome's and the Greeks, you know, I am going to move, move in my energy. So you are going to really, oh my God, the high priestess. So yeah, they're going to, whoever here, I'm here in Orion's belt, whoever was sort of tagging you up is going to be just spun out and rogs off the pond. This person was watching you. They wanted your crown worn on their hairline so badly, but they didn't even have, okay, hearsay of, okay, how to describe why it is that you're here with the clout that you, that, that, that you've been given. Some of you, this person here, whoever, they're very wormy. They were spreading some nasty lies about you, slander. And like your spirit guys were like, we don't, tackle this shit one-on-one -on -one. we make sure you tackle that goal of yours that's number one that's probably those are the priorities in the classroom i hear like that okay and i repeat it's not just you this is you with others okay you're pulling people through the testing room but you know these um it's like there's a lot of distraction a lot of chaos and a lot of haze with the world in reverse you know there's a lot of bullshit and it's okay spirit is saying that's the point of why we're here because there's gonna be this shit show it's gonna go down the shit's gonna hit the fan okay it's gotta hit somewhere it's gotta hit somewhere eventually the odds right we have to say Every, every op op possibility is is a possibility. So if it, if it is possible for it to happen, it will happen eventually. It had to happen. I hear like that. Okay, so you have to sort of um, be okay with that 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 gift as well that you have, which will trigger people who are not ready to ascend to the level that you are encouraging others to. And so they want to. It's kind of like if I, they can't do it, they want to take everybody else down. Kind of bullshit. If, if they can't do it, they want to take everybody. Yeah, where they're where they're gonna go to next to do their karma, which is like that makes no sense because they don't have to do that karma. It's your karma. You you know, so it's kind of like, yeah, misery loves company. But you're you got your own company here, so that's yours, and you're gonna get. I mean, these karmics, these karmics have it coming so slippery. It's gonna get slippery on the. Uh, oh no, it's gonna get real bad, guys. This plane, this planet won't tolerate. You know, the choices that are made with suffering in mind like you know for oneself or others like and you um you've you've lit pe you've lit you light so many people up sagittarius like you are a light you're a beaming light here i see that with the world in reverse the ten of cups up right like you um you are but i just see humble in you and the ten of cups up right like you are not trying to be anybody to these people Try, uh, yeah i'm seeing like some nickelodeon slime just dropping it's like they can try to interrupt you they can try to you know what's that yeah i mean what's that show sticks show sticks and stones break my bones but words will never hurt me they could try whatever they can try on you but you're it's your light they cannot they cannot fake your light okay they cannot fake that like these people even trying to look like you dress like you talk like you i'm hearing madeline you know uh, and it's not it's 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 nothing but further definition to the choices that they're making karmically return to center anybody who behaves like this especially towards somebody who's in the light um doesn't understand the principle of karma because if you saw that what you give to another is coming right back to you and it's no different than that you wouldn't i mean hello it's a huge waste of your time i heard like that i mean you're in nathaniel return to center wow they've tried to frame you let's clear that uh-huh somebody here has tried to put to put slander uh, upon your name okay and so um i'm here and i come from a land down under something about australia you're zooming up ahead the i mean this is just proof like you don't that the thing is the irony is that this doesn't impact you you know, it's like they're thinking that they're shouting and screaming is going to make you miss the fr free throw layup, you know, in the hoop. 
you yeah you already made it their their screams come a, a little bit delayed if you know what i mean okay because the way you were you're moving so high vibrationally you are all, what your reality is already manifest they're seeing it late like they see a shooting star thinking okay here's our shot like let's go capture like all the drop the, the the drops of the yeah it's like you know the fireworks when they kind of they kind of scatter about in the sky. It's like, this is so silly. Okay. This is something that it, it has no manner to it in, in the, in the kingdom of, of, of how we live truly in this, in this day and age, in this, in this, in this uh, experience that we call life on this plane, especially like they don't understand clearly shadow bearers do not, they're not understanding clearly how it is that we survive on this plane. It's by way of energy. So true energy observation would we disqualify this type of behavior so clearly. I mean, they cannot survive, you guys. You don't have to worry about these such people. I'm here in Skyhawk. You have so many guides here who are responsible for how it is that. Yeah, so we got the devil. You, let me say it in 3D. Look at this. Just re <laughs> lower back. They're trying to do. They're trying to do solar plexus spells on you. Um, they're trying to deflate your solar plexus. Okay. Energy. They're doing, um, root chakra spell work on you. Sacral chakra. You are so it's boomeranging. It's going, it's refracting. Um, cause when they try to hit you, they hit your community as well. And, um, that is so heavily protected. You are, you, it's your, when they try to hit you, they hit your purpose. Your purpose is so fucking strong. It's unshakable. You are rooted into the ground of this earth. Okay. As yes, a pillar of the conversation we're having here. Why are we here on this plane? You have been part of that. The founding. Okay. The, the, the yeah, the founding. Okay. The state of our awareness here on this plane, you have been one of those who helped found that I hear like this. Okay. That, 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 that healing, that healing method and model. How do we say like the irony? Okay. This reminds me of the read recently we did where the irony, yeah, like your haters, whoever that was, they're going to need you. It was a Pisces reading um, when they're going to need you. Like, but they were taking advantage of your magic. And then comes the day where it's like your magic could have saved them. Should they have allowed you to stay in control of it, have it, as yours and acknowledge it as it was and as it has been i'm hearing that song by harry styles as it was and then here's the you know here's the irony they you know they cannot be your magic they cannot have your magic and in this lifetime they will go down because of that they will see it return to center lower back lower root chakra down the right side on the lower right side root on the lower right side of the root chakra on the lower right right hand side of the root chakra this is a huge time on earth right now. Like this is so much past life karma. These contracts here, um, this is big. This is not just like 2023. This is like, you ready? Y'all ready for this? Okay. And Sagittarius, I'm telling you, we speak spirit hasn't been shy about, yeah, exposing how involved you are. I'm your an ancestral. Okay. Ancestrally. Um, you're literally, okay. You're on, you're on the front line. Okay. You've been, you, yeah. I mean, you're in foragers. Okay. You're going back to, you know, for foraging life. Okay. There's something that has been ingrained, rooted. Your ancestral lineage is so incredibly powerful. And that is what you bring to this world today. You bring that full circle. You bring the past to know the future just that much better. I'm hearing healing. I'm hearing hail. Hmm. Yeah. So some of you, I mean, you hail from a Royal bloodline and there's nothing that changes that you cannot change your blood type. You cannot change your bloodline. People would have loved to switch timelines with you. Okay. Back then today, tomorrow, that won't change. And so, but you'll be out of orbit enough to the point where you won't see much of much of even what happened to these people. Okay. I'm gonna say it like that. Like once you, when, yeah, once you move into this, this next phase, like it's kind of like, you know, your secretary is going to handle that. Your, uh, you know, you, yeah, your higher self has just sort of checked out of, you know, that energy. It doesn't bother you the way it used to. I mean, you're just going to get too big here, Sagittarius, to put any mind, any business, any matter to any of that. Um, the devil, the hierophant. It's like, you know, when you have a cold and, you know, they say you cannot get the same cold twice. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Okay, absolutely, exactly. Won't vibrate on the same plane, the Dianico. Yeah. So you are, um, let's go. Lower back. I see USPS. Yeah. So um, 
I see Secret Service with you on the astral. Like, you literally, like, they're taking you into a new room. It's like, here you go. The devil of the heart font. How you feel now? It's only getting better. It's only going to get bigger. It's only going to become more of what it's been. And it's going to be what you want, not what other people wanted to take you to experience alongside themselves. What you have brought others to recognize also in themselves that they could also experience. And that's where we say the selflessness, this humbleness, this, I'm doing it for the world. I'm doing it for others alongside me. I'm not into ascent, not like we're all here with trauma bonding, but we are ascending. And that's where this truth becomes known in the 3d of what this really means for you. And that means for some of you, you're going to let's return to center third eye left-sided body you got someone very jealous on you said sure but anyways and now uh yeah the devil in the higher font i'm hearing tap her tap her maybe somebody here wants to try and tap your shit whatever bye trying to steal your magic i heard like that um or literally tap in and get you know so um you gotta make sure yeah for some of you you then that will come spirit's gonna bring in some serious protection here you're not gonna deal with none of that anymore it's like you used to not know not a thing you had vulnerabilities when it came to maybe your technology maybe you start dating someone who is or you get to know someone you're gonna start yeah networking with people someone you're gonna have like let's say now a c a c t o chief technology officer and that person i mean they're gonna handle all that stupid bullshit trolls trying to hack you and your computer whatever you know something like that it's like gonna be more professional more official this is um yeah definitely um much more much more like it okay i heard like that like you're gonna just be looking at yourself in the mirror like i can see i can see this i can see this being yeah being being where 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 i've been at okay for a long time like it just feels right sits right it's like you feel you deserve it but you know it's not because it's not why you're there it's not like i deserve this where is it you know it's like i'm here and i embrace that this has been where i've been at in my heart space to be feeling that this is my expectation of also how i want to live you know and that's where you're going to experience what you've given to others like we say you're going to feel reciprocity you're going to say no, I don't just want to give. I also want to acknowledge that I have given and it's I who has given my time, my energy. Okay. It return to center. This is the shadow Neptune where these trolls want to make you feel small. They want to make you feel like, yeah, no, like you owe it to us to do this. Okay. Yeah. You don't need to be given in return. Oh, you, you know, you don't really, yeah, you're not doing much. You're not doing much. It's like a exploitation energy, gaslighter energy type of thing. Um, narc energy. And you know, you're realizing, no, it's both ways. And it's, and it's because you're intentional. It's because you're authentic and because you're genuine reach the center again yeah somebody's trying to like put thoughts in your mind that you're like a bad person or something this is such ridiculousness um you know and, and, but the thing is you know it's like i am here and i know why and and i am now here and i know why like and that's because your intention has been so pure so it's interesting because you sort of see it after you manifest it and you enjoy it though. I see that with the devil and the higher font and you're going to enjoy that shit. Sagittarius, you return to center and you, wow. It's like, they want you as like a, their slave or something, you know, those, that's those energies. These people who, you know, maybe in a past life, maybe you're like, a, you're going to be a mega millionaire here in this lifetime. Maybe you used to give the ideas to someone, an overlord type who used your ideas, made millions off of them. And then you were just kind of like sitting there on the, on the list of people who were involved, but those are your ideas. Okay. In this lifetime here, Sagittarius, now you're going to be the person. Okay. And for yourself here. And that is exactly where you're headed to with the devil. Mm -hmm. Let's clear on the sacral. That's exactly where, you know, you're going to heal. I'm hearing as well that consciousness that tells you that you need to like still hang out with these people. I mean, who the fuck are these people? The three of swords and the world universe. These are just people, the four cups universe, people who are past life drains. Okay. And, and, and you know who they are because you are very sensitive Sagittarius. You are very, very, um, tuned in. You know, when someone here has a North node on you or a South node contact and you know, they, do they drain you? return to center the sacral, you know, do, do they tell you that you can do better or do they make you feel bad about what you've always been doing already? Okay. And so we, that's where we say always, 
these people don't change you who and what you do and what you do is who you are. So it comes down to, you don't know me, bitch. I heard like that. You don't tell me what I'm going to do here on this world. Okay. I hear like that. And you just step right out of their mind, their mind games, the trap and all of what it is. Okay. That, 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 that they think, okay. Makes you their queen. They don't own you Sagittarius. And this is where you're going to step into a new tier with the devil in the higher font financially. Literally. I mean, you're not going to need nobody here for nothing. I mean, your finances here, with the devil and the hierophant, the ace of pentacles we're looking forbes we're looking um what is that whole thing under 25 whatever it is you know not only um we're looking your own tier sagittarius and and it is about um who you meet there as well okay this is your network this is your extension you know by way of how many rings out you are not going to be the same person and the people around you will be changing as well also your mind about who you are going to become so this is where you have a much better group and social network around you that's going to match the person you've been to the people around you in the past year. So this is extremely exciting, Sagittarius. You have something coming for you and I'm here and just sit, just keep keep moving with your, yeah, with your timeline, okay? Because it's yours. You you have brought it to this plane. Let's move into what, um, anything else? I mean, I feel like I want to just leave there for you, Sagittarius. Let's just leave that right there. Let's just drop the mic on that note right there for you. What do you say? <laughs> Let's move into the next sign. Let's do here, um, I'm hearing Ryan. I like pina coladas. Really, Alex? How do you drink but a mama doesn't even drink? My friend gave me a taste one time when we... <laughs> Alex is starting to... His voice really coming out. He wants to do some story time. I remember you were doing that one story time, remember? Oh, yeah, Charlotte at the bar. I remember her. <laughs> Anyways, before we get all up into that again. Put my hand on this thing. How, how do we use this thing? Oh, my God. You guys hear it when he's looking at it? All right. All right, Alex. Maybe I'll have a separate little video for you. How about it? I like pina coladas. All right. Capricorn, let's do it. Should we? That's how we entered in with Virgo. There could be a focus on Virgo. Getting lost in the rain. <laughs> What's the, how does that song go? Dun, 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 dun. All right. ASMR puppy paws. I don't know. I think for wh whatever reason, like you can't really hear it, right? You can't hear that? Like when we do that? Okay. Anyways, let's get serious. Let's get loud. Let's get loud. Something going on. Turn to center. It's cleared in the crown, up on the right side of the crown, in the root chakra, sacral chakra. Something about a cat. Capricorn, let's do it. Okay. Oh, I'm here. She got a bubble butt. What's that song? Alex, where are you learning these songs from? Oh, you know, I got some friends and maybe, maybe like an older crowd. They listen to different stuff and I was in the room. So, uh, <laughs> all right. So, what's going on today? Today. Oh, we'll take a day by day, Capricorn. Capricorn wants a card for each of the days of 2023 to 2026. What's going on, Capricorn? Who you? Who you really? Oh, he's a Capricorn moon. That makes sense. You ready? Y'all ready for this? <laughs> Let's return to sender. You doing some DJ? Pump up the audience. Y'all ready for this? He feels like maybe y'all are bored or something. Or maybe that's just him coming in. I just want to chime in. No, no. Like, like check. Okay, so... <laughs> 
Let's do it. Capricorn. Let's return to center. <laughs> you just shook off like, ah, spending too much time with mommy. Got mommy vibes on me. I got to go back to my friends where we're singing about pina coladas and that's booty booty. What? I feel like, listen, I could just imagine them as, as like children, real kids. You know? I feel like, Al we talked about this before. I feel like Alex... He'd be kind of having that side to him, you know, the bad boy, a little bit of bad boy. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Let's just continue. <laughs> booty booty was a Virgo read. Oh. Oh. My Jane. Bra 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 bra. Don 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 don. What's with the music coming in? Smashing pumpkins. Okay. <laughs> Oh my god, Alex is being so silly right now. He's in such a mood right now. He's just like all up in the mood of it. He's being like silly and playful. Actually, oranges. <laughs> Get it? Okay. Oh my god. I'm going to drop a few thou right there, I think. A few thou on what? What you buying? No, I'm going to drop a few thou followers just for that right. I mean, that right there. I'm hearing the name Rachel. I'm hearing MLK. So I'm MLK. Hmm. Milk? I'm hearing his milk as well. Oh, maybe they want more milk. Give him a little bit of milk. Okay, what? Oh my God. Capricorn, are we going to focus? Let's get physical. Oh, my God. Jade has a Mercury in cap. I'm hearing Bee Gees. Something about the Bee Gees. I'm hearing booty, booty, booty. What? <laughs> What's with this gyration? I feel like I kind of want to pay attention to them right now. Hi, dolls. Hi. We're going to take a little break, guys. In the meantime, hit the like button. Let's get at least to like set three something. Yeah. Jade, it's like a toga. Your heart is rotated, doll. Ow! Your tooth is very sharp. Booty, booty, booty. What's with the booty? Booty clap, clap. Okay. I feel like Alex would like film some like inappropriate music video <laughs> if he were like you know really hi Alex booby. Maybe he got it from his mama because I'm always I be well you saying booby I can say booty. If you say booby I say booby booty 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 booties hi booby. Or it's a booty the booties of puss in boots. All right. That's all I was saying. I was just listening to your shorts, Nat. You were saying something about Puss in Boots with, with his booties, tiger stripe booby booties. That's what I was saying. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Okay, guys. Nice. Excuse me, Jade. That's a, that's very very OnlyFans right there. Probably not doing none of that at all. Okay, on this here live. You're about to get us disqualified. I'm seeing something about a jelly bean. <laughs> Aww. All right, dolls. Yes. Oh, munchkin. Return to center. Booty, booty, booty. Damn, that booty, that booty clap. I'm hearing blue, blue. Plus or minus a little bit of, a little bit of Monica in my life. Uh-oh. All right. -na -na -na. <laughs> Let's just clear the energy. Oh, my God. I'm trying to center. I don't know what kind of, kind of calibration that is. So. 
If someone's embarrassed about something, let's get into a Capricorn. What's up? If it's your first time here, by the way, welcome. Yeah, I hear it like that. Damn. Damn. I don't know, man. Damn. Booty, booty. I don't know. What? Ugh, Capricorn, stop. Listen, you do this. I'm not, I'm not. You know how I tell them? You're going to do that. You're going to put you in the playpen. I'm going to put you in the astral playpen, Capricorn. <laughs> All right, booty booty. It's like <laughs> it's like Judy Judy. Wait, a, um, I am. Um, I don't know what's this about. It's like someone be joking a bit. This reminds me of the Aquarius reading. I see mischievous. I see a little bit of like Aries as well. Someone's walking with like a bit of like a crimp. What do they call it? A crimp crimp walk. Oh, fuck. Oh, good. I saw it now. I've dropped a card on it. Just because is flying eight of cups pimp walk right so <laughs> someone has their eye on somebody i'm hearing you see him someone here has maybe some crimp tear maybe they got some he's someone's in love with someone he's got purple shades on he's got a crimp crimp he's got a crimped uh weave i'm hearing he's got a crimped mo mode weave and he's got um a yeah whatever they call it, the pimp the pimp walk I'm hearing oh God forbid I'm hearing statutory rape what oh no let's clean these cars up no no okay hold up so who this is well who you're releasing the star okay just let's mm. okay Capricorn listen up. yeah I'm here <laughs> he's got a Mercury and Capricorn. I'm listening. What's going on, Jade? No, oh, no. Someone, you're going to hear about them. You're going to hear what they've been doing, you guys. And you're going to run. Run for the hills. This guy's... This Maybe he even has a little voice like that. Hey, it's me. That's fucking weird. That is weird. That's creepy. You guys are no, you're gonna see his record. I'm hearing he's a predator. Some of you, you're gonna run. <laughs> Where's my oh no? Where's my where's my Uber? I don't know. You're gonna have to have a game plan. This is some creepy shit. Some of you, I don't know what this is something. Like he was maybe doing drugs somewhere. I don't know, man. Something about a hotel. I'm here in Knox, Fort Knox, Fort Knoxville. It's a hard Knox life. It's like you maybe met somebody off a of date. Oh my God, I don't know. Return. Guys, give me a sec. I need water. Is there anything left in here? Barely anything going here. I just realized I didn't have dinner. It's like you gotta awkwardly get out of this date. I don't know how I, uh, yeah, <laughs> uh -huh. it's like you just heard about his record or something. No, I, I had like jalapenos. My mouth is on fire. I need some water. So like you got to get out of there. He you saw he, it in his eyes. Maybe he's kind of creeping you out. Hi, Jade. Hi, Bulbers. Ba -na 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 -na. I don't know. You were maybe at the club or something. Ba -na 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 Maybe he keeps trying with you. Dun 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 dun. Y'all ready for this? No, no. I'm not. How do I get home? I'm that I can't. I gotta go. I saw something. I don't know what. Maybe you researched him while you were on the date, and this was you were pulling up some weird stuff. Like he got locked up. I'm hearing that. Yeah, for real, he did. He was maybe in a gang or something. I don't know for everybody wise. He was doing something. Okay. So we turn sender. So I just see you not wanting to just involved in this, you know. You, no, no, Isaac, Isaac, I'm sorry. I made our contact with him. He thought I was going to turn. Okay, so hold on, Isaac. Wait, wait, doll. Uh, six of, yeah, you have to get. <laughs> Isaac, Isaac, wait. Full be. You're gonna have to get out of this. <laughs> You're gonna have to get out of this Capricorn. I don't know, man. You're 
you're you're involved in something strange here a little bit okay it's like you don't want to be a witness god forbid or something i don't know maybe this is your friend or something okay babysit him jade go for it so you gotta get out it's like you're getting out of the club you gotta take the stairs up Gotta get. I know. I gotta get out of here. The elevator is taking too long. So the father stores in reverse. Like you just gotta bolt it. He's about to sing a Michael Bolton song. I gotta go. Turn to center. I'm gonna sing a song to my mother tonight. Yeah, she's actually. Yeah, I gotta sing a song to her first. I'm gonna call her up. I promised I would sing her a song. It's like you gotta make the most on. It could be something illegal. It's like maybe, you know, you say, no, no, I'm not allowed to, like, say that, talk to you about this. I don't know. Something going on. Maybe you're in the studio. I don't know, man. You're, you're, uh, you know this person through another person. You started talking to them and then you, you, like, regret it right in the beginning. <gasps> hey, be gentle, dolls. Hey, be gentle. Okay, come here, Isaac. That's not nice. He very rough. Hey, don't do that, Jade. Oh shit! I just take this stupid glasses off. Let's get out of here. Oh my god! Yeah, what are we doing in that rave, Isaac? Here, I'm gonna raise a concern with the principal. Jade, are you being a bully? It's like he's a little. I see you getting kind of scared of this person. It's like. Uh oh, he's gonna wonder where I am. It's like you you said be right back and then you just ran away. I hear that. <laughs> Maybe you were on a date. <laughs> okay, so um, you were at a party even, like someone, you know, he just started giving you the hebeous, jeebious energy. Some of you, God forbid, there is an SED. He told you maybe about that. He said he's going to be careful. I don't know. Oh, my God. You got had to get out of there. I'm here and you got slash had to get out of there. So some of yeah, some of you. Okay, guys, you need to please hold on. Um, I'm here in Har Harriston. Harriston. Harristown. I see you getting a cab. Booking it out of that. Even the county. I don't know why you drove so far to meet someone who you're just not familiar with. But, yeah, let's get further. Who are you releasing? Six of Wands and Moon. Yeah. You knew it. It's like, this is sketchy as hell. Okay. He was obviously... Yeah. Uh, let's get further on to what else you're releasing. You met them through light. Yeah. Just whatever. Let's move on. You're releasing um, someone who, like, thought... You, um, hmm. This is, like, someone who doesn't have the right morals here. Okay. There's a lot of, like, gotta cut these people out of my life. It's like, this person, though, is more like of a, um, not, it could even be a relative. It could be a family friend I'm hearing that even. Someone who just doesn't have the right, um, ethics when it comes, yeah, uh, return to sender. Like, they don't return it against a sender. It's your manager, or they want it to be, or they want, you guys were co-partnering. You can't see a future. Let's see on what else it is you're releasing. Let's feel one more there. The Emperor again with the Fool. Could be that person and their friend. Let's get into the next read. You may have to sell off property related to that person or just do something and make it really clear you're not interested. Let's get in, yeah, into, because uh, everything was getting weird. Like everything related to that person was just getting weird. It was going into this, like you, weird stuff's ha happening. I'm seeing raspberry. Let's get into the sign. Uh, well, the, the what what is it that you're coming into? Just getting weird. I'm here on happy go lucky. Hmm. Maybe it was just too many red flags. Um, too many like pluses as well. Maybe you didn't even get involved, but like, yeah. Okay, let's just get a little bit further. What's you coming into, Capricornia? You really got to clear the high priestess. Like, you don't want to explore that. Uh, you, for some of you, you're going to come into a period of some of you gonna um, you're gonna have a major awakening. Wow. Some of you may meet a high priestess. You're going to, some of you be in a relationship with this person. You're going to realize something big here, the higher font. You're going to have probably a long-term connection with this person. I'm hearing something about Baltimore. I'm hearing British Columbia and I'm hearing DC. I'm hearing Maryland. I'm hearing uh, Del uh, Delaware. Ugh, what? DE, <laughs> Delaware, right? Um, I'm hearing something about the Bronx. I'm hearing Navy Yard. Navy, something about the Navy, Navy hood, Navy, Navy, something city, uh, mother of cops, 
Three of Wands, something about military even. Okay, possibly. Or a, pl a place with, like, strong military presence. Like, for instance, like, they have a, some kind of site there. Like, um, a military land, reservoir, what do they call it? Um, like, a field, a, te well, a testing field. For instance, like, in Okinawa, they had that, you know, it's like famous. Yeah, they got the presence of the American military there, I think. Five of Pentacles there, the Seven of Pentacles, the Ace of... So it's some kind of like property. Um, I see you getting really like this is a dramatic. Oh, yeah, the high priestess again. You're going to even change your career field. How do we say return to center? There's something. You hey, hey, stop that. That's too crazy, Jay. Don't do that. Calm down, okay? That's enough. Jay, it's time for a timeout. Come. Go inside. You have to be gentle with Isaac. Alex, Alex. Alex, come here. Go inside, Jay. Go inside, good boy. Alex, come here. Good boy. Go inside. Good boy. Stay. Don't. Hi. Okay. Yeah. Um, you really... I see you changing, uh, like, the page with your love life, the page with your friends, and then you're... Your social circles and then also your finances. So um, I see awakening. And it's going to start with this person. I see that person being your long-term partner. And I feel like it's like one of those moments where it's like, oh my God, you literally got me out of that. Let's get into the next read of Aries. The last sign. Thank you so much, everybody here for tuning in. Hit the like button. Let's try to get to 400 likes during Aries. Um, it really does help this channel expand when you hit the like button. It tells YouTube, hey, like we're liking this content. Post it up on feeds of people who maybe are not even looking for tarot. So that's really cool. Um, thank you again for making a difference with that. Let's get here. Aries, what are you releasing? A lot of fake friends. There were a lot of fake ass friends, frenemies here, frenemy energies here uh, in the air and all around. And you're just going to like go of all that, the gossip, the t nonstop talking. Okay. About just BS shit, chatter, white noise. You're going to release all of the outlet to that. Pe you know, it's like, why do I start? I'm here in PD Pablo. Why do I start? you know, thinking about this. Oh, cause my friend's talking about that. It's like, you're going to just delete that, clear that. You're not going to be following that person anymore. You're on. Yeah. You're unsubscribing even from like certain, I am hearing, Oh, tarot readers fault. You know, there's something you're just going to spruce up. Like you're realizing it's not feeding and fueling your consciousness in a healthy way. We have the fool. I do feel like people are going to try and frame you. This sounds like your yearly reading 2023. I'm here on the name Andre. It's like, Oh, Oh, we see. I'm here in Mar Mar Yeah, we. Oh, oh, you're too good for us. It's like fuck off. Like, why don't you, you can ascend too? Yeah, see, that, that, yeah, you see people's true colors when you choose yourself. Let's hear it get further. Not in a selfish way, but like in yeah, detox. Mm -hmm. That's why it's, they call Herxheimer's reaction. You'll have a social experiment going on here. Okay, see, see who who you yeah really um how people view you when you're choosing yeah higher light path, right? Finding. We have the Ace of Cups. Reminds me of even that first sign we did uh, where you were like, I don't know where I'm going. Anyways, Ace of Cups. What else are you really saying? Actually, I think that's it. I have Spirit is saying that that's it. Mm. Anything else though? Yeah, yeah I, I get drama is not your interest. You may even, yeah. So let's get into who you're coming into contact with. I'm here in Martin. We had the Empress. Oh, wow. You have major feats coming for you. You're um, in terms of your, t I'm here with something about a talent agency. You're going to move for some of you. It's something about your environment. Your finances are going to skyrocket. You literally are going to be for some of you like a household face. Like your people are going to know you. You're going to be known. I'm here in Hulu, something about television. Uh, you're you're going to be famous. Okay. That's just so-called famed, like literally your face. I'll say is famous. You're going to be famous because there's all, I mean, we're all famous. This is um, in our own way. This is your fame though, that is coming and it involves your iconization. Like people are going to see you. They're going to know you. They'll recognize you. Some of you, um, <laughs> it's going to become like a paparazzi thing for some of you. Like you're going to be that well known now, daughter of sorts. I'm here in he uh, heliotropic. What's that? Something about a muse. Some of you here, you may get a tattoo on your right forearm. I feel pressure on the right forearm. Like also when you're about to get blood drawn and like they have that really tight thing on your arm. Oh my God, I hate that thing. But yeah, I'm just seeing that anyways. Nine of Pentacles, maybe you hate that thing. Okay. N uh, daughter of swords. Um, I'm here in Vader. Some of you, um, let's see what else you're coming into. Let's go. 
this is definitely your glow up coming for some of you with the empress and the yeah i see you solo as well you're gonna go solo with something if you used to be working alongside like other people and like a very yeah look at that empress well look at that the judgment that's amazing kudos Congratulations, Aries. Please come back and let us know. Subscribe, hit the like button. Tell us how this went. How, what what transpired? What does this look like? Because I feel we'll all know, but we just want to see you in the comments. Okay, just for, yeah, it's fun. I want to see, you know, hey. Because for some of you, it's like, you know, it's, a, it's, a, it's just like right here, this little period where, you know, you're still like, maybe people don't know you that well, you know, it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Like, hey, like, you know, that's, yeah, that that's where that led to, you know, that that's like, well, that was my life back there. And, you know, so yeah, just do let us know because that's really cool. Four swords in reverse, the mother pentacles are bright. Some of you, you're really going to be just like, um, you can't walk through that grocery store without them glasses on for some of you. It's that type of. Mm -hmm. Now let's close on the right side body. This could be a metaphor as well, of course, right? Um, mm -hmm. I'm hearing R2D2. Yeah, you're maybe going to be in a movie. I'm hearing, you've, I'm hearing famous. No, no, like I just hear it just like that. So you're going to obviously, um, yeah, I'm saying something about uh, Sagittarius. I'm hearing Beyonce. I'm hearing Chanel. You may run the gamut with where this leads you. It can lead you to fashion it can lead you to film you know there are so many things that will come of this and i mean it's just not fair to say like this is one one contract it's so many that will be um you know it's a network okay yeah wow strength you're gonna meet someone here i'm here in ryan brian they want to i'm here in boom boom stand mike they want to take your work to the next level i'm here in african african africanas I see some kind of music here. Like you're going to get into all kinds of different types of beats and music. Um, yeah. Music, music shows. Um, Isaac way. I see something about um, even like uh, something with like um, DJ Isaac, you need to hold on return to center. I just like, I want to come. Hey, where's the show going to be at? Can I do some of this? Like open your open for you. I'll do the open. I <laughs> let me uh, pop, help you pop the bottle of champagne Aries. i'm here in such a darius let me help reach frogs up on the throw shower you're gonna have a lot of people here from your past as well i mean they're gonna want to come along for the ride but some of you you gotta you gotta be solo here you may get more like exclusively like, hey i can't really hang out sorry like can't explain what's going on yeah you're not gonna have time Aries. really i mean you're not gonna have also the vibrational capacity to still tune into the people who you did like tune into in the past and you know, they'll feel some sort of way about that, but hey, I mean, that's I mean, that's not why you're here. You're not here for people to also, like, make you feel guilty and you give in to that, right? You're not going to do that, Aries. No, no, no. And I mean, let's get real, you're Aries, okay? That's not usually Aries' problem. <laughs> He's about to buy it, yeah. You know, Shadow Aries. For those who are not aware, Shadow Aries can be known to be kind of selfish, okay? You gotta slow him down there with that, like, hey, like, can you remember me a bit back here? Okay, it's kind of funny, right, that I'm saying, hey, come back and comment, remind us. Uh, Jade, no crying. No barking. You have to wait. Uh -huh, yeah. Return to center. Yeah. I see a lot of people like, you're going to be so different. Like, they're going to be like, oh my God, hi, remember me? You know, but mm, <laughs> I mean, maybe the answer uh, in honesty is no. I mean, because you just changed so much. Like, maybe that's a metaphor. Like, maybe some people want to be friends with you. You're just not resonating with these people anymore. Like, you just cannot resonate with these people anymore. I hear like that. Um, there's no way that you can really like see anything happening with these people. Maybe, you know, these are people who wanted to like, they want to collab or something like they, some of you, you know, yeah, there's just something going on. Maybe, um, they want like you to maybe open them up to a certain network even. And you're like, okay, but I have to be really careful how I do that. I mean, even if I do, I see you, I see you. It's like the Leo read very similar to the Leo reading. Um, Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm hearing finally. Yeah, I see, I, I hear. I'm hearing that song, Etta James. At last, woo, my love has come along. I see you just like singing. Some of you, maybe you're a singer. You're like enjoying like what this your life is leading to, and you know honestly, you're sitting in that. That makes me think of Sagittarius. Like you're sitting in that. You're not rewinding the tape. You know, see, you know, you're not in that. Like, let me look back and see if so and so got back to me. You're not thinking about your exes. You're not thinking about 
the people who didn't get back to you when you were all y'all were networking and duetting and they're going to look at you like, Hey, like what happened? You know, but it's, um, I don't see that they're like per se shady, but I mean, you do have some shady, some shady hang gliders. Don't we all, but you, yeah, Leamber, there's someone particular, like this person wants you to like help him out. Like, it's like, mm, I don't think it fits. Come here. I think what will be. Yeah, the lovers in reverse. You may start to just really um there's just you have different interests now, okay? Yeah, you have just way different even taste, you know, maybe in music or in Jade, no barking. You have to wait. He really needs to learn with that. He's too squeaky sometimes. You know, it's when it's play pen time, you time to chill. Okay, Son of Swords and the Mother of Pentacles. So mm -hmm, let's get further. to a cop's father father wants um if you have a dog i don't know if you heard that but yeah your dog may kind of go wild on that sound um we're doing it again what in the rebel yeah maybe even like you're just like i don't have time to like get back to all these people who like want to be my friend now i'm hearing that i don't know you're just i see you just kind of like you don't have a problem cutting contracts i'm hearing these girls ain't loyal like I don't have time to sing the song like they know they're not loyal so bye like it's just what it is like I don't you're not getting caught up even in drama of like what's not working because you just got so much shit going on I mean your life like you got high vibrations I'm hearing high vibrations with a song you got so much like life to live as well like you don't have time to see like why things are not working like I mean maybe it may come off like be beware you know it may come off as a bit like oh you're just forgetting about us okay like you forgot about me like I'm here like that like suddenly you just, yeah, it's kind of extreme. Like, you know, you shift poles here, Aries, you do, but I mean, you also have to, you know, maybe it is an X, you know, I don't know. Maybe they will get kind of, you know, sensitive, like, you know, Hey, you hear me in here. I'm hearing that song again by Usher. Like someone maybe used to like hook up with even, you're not like excited anymore. Like your work is starting to replace maybe karmic energies. Okay. I don't know for everybody here, you know, exactly what this may be, but it's just stuff that, it's like, yeah, we used to hang out in the day and like, but you can't like not change because of these people. Like, don't take your crown off because someone here doesn't understand why you're wearing it that high. It's like, it's a crown, motherfucker. <laughs> it's a crown, bitch. It's you supposed to put it on your, yeah. So you can't, ex you can't slow down and explain this shit to people. You can't, well, you can't explain this, to, this, this concept of elevation. So, and I do feel like, you know, these are things that you've really, you've acted on, you've been brave. And you know, that's what led you here. And you can't feel bad for people who are like, Hey, what about me? Like, hello. It's like, I'm hearing Aquarius. Um, <laughs> default Pisces trade, right? <laughs> um, Isaac. <sighs> I say that because I know Divine Echo is a Pisces. Oh, it, I don't know if that's too a TMI. You know what? I am just like blabber mouthing. <laughs> I need to think before. Maybe that someone doesn't want that note. Okay. But yeah. Oh, Isaac. It's like maybe you're realizing like these people, it's not even like these girls ain't loyal. It's like, it's just way more neutral than that. It's like these people too high maintenance. You know, it's like you maybe used to sing that song. You're not into it as much anymore. This reminds me of that one, the Leo. Where you're deleting your social media. Oh, if you... Ow, I think that's, like, very, like, much a little string right there. Okay. If you used to be on socials heavily, if you have a lot of Leo and Aries, I'm here in Brad the Rock. It's like, I do feel... I'm going to be honest here. If you are dealing with an Aries, I'm here in Ain't No Sunshine Where She's Gone. Every time she goes away. Yeah, she doesn't really I'm sorry, but she's on cloud motherfucking nine. Like she doesn't really want to go back to eight talk things out, you know, it's just not where she's at. Like I'm hearing it like this. Like if you're wondering if this person really missing you and sad and somber and s sallow, sallow, is that a word? They're not. The answer is they're not. So they're just, oh. Jay, no crying, no barking. Oh my God. 
he needs to really learn, like, really, really learn this. I'm not as consistent nor as assertive with Jade as I was with Alex and training him with that. And Isaac, I was also very focused on him with that. So, you know, got to start getting more consistent. I'm going to go through a real training phase with Jade and we got to get that really because I'm not tall. I mean, he's almost a year old, guys. He was born in December. Return to him back. December, yeah. So, I mean, he, we got to get this like, yeah, before he's one year. Okay. I know he's vocal, but he needs to like respect me. And like when I'm saying nah, like he needs to know, like that's a nah. Okay. Yeah. It's up to me. This is our household. So let's return to center. Now, um, let's just go. You know, um, <laughs> yeah. So it's just like, um, it's important. Yeah. And sometimes it's, yeah, those things are not really important. Okay. So we need to know what's important. Like maybe someone feeling kind of bad, like, Hey, you don't want to hear me sing anymore. It's like, uh, no, it's like, maybe you're starting to train a bit like they're you're starting to get it's like a little bit like aries doesn't laugh at my jokes anymore aries is not really like in my vibe i see you with like a professional looking coat on like you're dressing spiffy you have a work outfit i don't know this is for some like uh, aries is kind of changing like aries is kind of not really like at home anymore for yeah it's funny because isaac is an aries venus i like myself and if divine echo you don't mind me spilling the beans but you also have a venus aries right um, so yeah, that's kind of interesting right there. Um, this is Aries. So yeah, do watch your Venus sign, your Mars sign. Um, that may, yeah, you're rising all signs. Just watch, I would say all signs because they all rel relate in some way to your birth chart. But yeah, uh, I would say more so like some more than others. Trust your intuition. Sometimes certain like periods, those signs will be really particular. Um, like I remember this one week, Taurus was just so motherfucking spot on for me. It was crazy. It was weird. I was like, okay, uh, am I Taurus actually? <laughs> yeah, it was you can just follow your intuition with that because there's so many transits, you know, and um, the easiest way is to just obviously you just follow your intuition. Like, don't second guess it. If you're like, I want to watch Taurus like this month or I want to watch Virgo like today, you know, just trust that because you could be going through a transit where like that's just really going to click and your guides have a very, very, very uncanny message for you there. We are all signed. So anyways, let's get further. It's like, yeah, like Aries, I feel someone here. Maybe it's a good friend or a family member. It's like they're kind of like they got arms folded like, hey, like Aries, I mean. They're feeling very triggered a bit. Yeah. Three of Wands, a high priestess. Yeah. Some of you, you're also going to come out like of your shell and like maybe some people like they feel weird because you're not someone that they can relate to in the same way anymore. And it's like, they feel weird. They, that, yeah, they, they don't know. I'm hearing dum, dum, dee, dum, 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 dee, dum, dum, ba, ba, da, ba, ba, da, ba, ba, yeah. Let's get the layer. Uh, well, let's just move on. It's like, wait, what? Like, you don't want to, like, you used to spend 30 minutes hanging out with people. Now you can spend like three minutes. Maybe it's a reality. You're too busy. You know, it's like, hey, what's up? Like, I got to go, like, have a cold call. Maybe you're working really hard. So, but for some of the Empress and the Mother Pentacles, like, you're going to be raking it in. It's like, I don't blame you a little bit. You know, you, I mean, you're just putting two to, yeah, I have to be myself for myself right now. Like, what's up? Like, you're not in the mood anymore, like, for these other types of karmics. Oh, karmic. There are some karmic energies, you know, they, yeah. Yeah, yeah. They want to make you feel bad, though. Like, oh, okay. It's like, I'm not here to make you happy. Like, if you're not happy, that's your problem. Fight, yeah, that's your, that's your life. Why you are dependent on me to be happy? That's not cool. Don't, don't put any, anything of your own shadow on another person. That makes them want to run more, especially in Aries. Okay? Aries will tolerate none of that. No, no, they will not tolerate none of that. Okay? Okay, so, uh, no. <laughs> and they're going to be brash about it. Like, kind of like how Sage said, like, your brother, they, they just, they're just, they, they know how to just, like, clean the slate and, like, delete that and not worry about it. It's like, that's not the type of person that is going to tolerate none of this. And it may feel brash and maybe, like, they're cutting you off and maybe they are, they probably are, especially, like, the more shadow that this was or whatever it is, or the more that it doesn't, it's not compatible any longer with their current reality. Why is the chat, the chat's frozen? Maybe refresh. Um, you know, um, I don't know what happened. To, to, anyway, so, um, yeah, the more that, again, I just see these jokes are now short and curt, and it's just more real, honestly, though, for you, like, because you're being honest, like, I just don't have the time. Like, so it's not something that you maybe you're trying to, yeah, anyways. <sighs> but, yeah, I feel like a lot of this energy is just, 
you just yeah it's over yeah with the star yeah but you're gonna be famous i mean aries you are that makes me think you said frozen that makes you think of the disney movie frozen okay anyways this is your this is your 2023 reading your yearly go check that readout because this is that exact theme that came through where it was like People are going to be like, oh, look at you, Aries. you got an attitude on you. That exact phrase, I'm hearing that. Go check out that read. Because that message right here. Look at this globe. Some of you are going to be a public presenter. Like, you got to get serious. It's like, it's maybe like an older brother with a younger brother. Like, oh, you're acting so serious now. It's like, we used to like always play like skateboarding games or something. It's like, you return center. Something about, uh, yeah. You're starting to maybe even just get into like something going on. Hmm. Yeah, I do feel like you're detaching physically. Like you're not spending time around older people that you were around a lot. It's not just yeah, it's physical, like um, not only physical, but it's your your mental framework is not is not like you're just literally. There aren't situations where you can relate to the pe these people anymore. Like you know what I'm saying? It's like we used to talk about homework. We don't have that class anymore together. You know what I'm saying? We used to talk about those problems. We don't have those problems on the same paper. It's a little nostalgic. Like I am hearing that song. So let's chivab it up now. What's that song? Um, yellow. When we go home, when together. Dun dun dun. Yeah. So, anyways. It reminds me of that read. Um, what was it? It was one of the signs here where you were kind of sad, like, bye. And was uh, one of those, it was a cancer, the soul contract. Like, it was kind of hard to step away, but like you had to do it. Um, and then you had to travel, go on your way. We saw the camper, the RV, something about touring. Maybe you're going on to, you know, there's just something here. And it's like, you got to do this. Like you're graduating. It's like, yeah. And some of you are getting married and it's like, you're married now. You don't have time to like hang out with your friends like you used to. And like, honestly, anybody who expects that is kind of selfish and inconsiderate. So you being so called selfish and inconsiderate is just a reflection to them of their own energy. Like, okay, you're being selfish and inconsiderate. If you're expecting of me to be the same person, I, you know, why do you need me to be? Yeah. So it's like their unhappiness is becoming obvious. Like when you have more of a, your own life um, and you're going to see like, yeah, yeah. Um, I remember, oh, so like we can't talk now. Like they're kind of making issues. They're kind of trying to probe you, and you're like, no, I already said it's because of this. It's not because of that. Like they're maybe thinking, oh, well, maybe Rich, just you're gonna have to separate from. You're gonna need um, maybe physical distance. Maybe you thought I can tolerate this. Like I'll still live with these people, but then I'll be in this new setting or space. In my mind, even it's like, nah. I actually have to like surround myself with people who are actually in my state of mind. Some of you're gonna, yeah, you're gonna, yeah, three of swords. So you didn't maybe you're realizing I'm holding on because I don't want them to feel bad. That's not gonna fly. Some of you here, whoever this is, okay. Um, you know, you uh, and this person, like them expecting you to be a certain person forever is, or for a certain period of time, or, you know, is um, revealing selfishness. And so you're sort of reacting with self-love. And if that is interpreted as selfishness, it's pretty illuminating as to where they stand with themselves. We'll see in the next video, Aries. It's, it's, it's pretty illuminating as to where they... Um, where they where they are invested in their own reality right like so are they being are they being selfish to themselves um overly focusing on another person is not fair to your to your own mission everybody has one and it's like yeah everybody has one it's about self-awareness and being brave enough to explore that let's get in anywhere else someone is someone coming in what's a new contract here aries are we seeing some of you may adopt a pet an animal some of you you're going to get um i see privacy though with you i feel like you are um yeah and i feel like someone here you may have to eventually detach from who um wait isaac who wanted something from you and you realize if you see that it's an ultimatum and I feel like you're not turning back. You're not, you're not going to interpret it any other way. You're not going to be pulled. You're not going to be, um, wavering. You're not going to be, um, misunderstanding why you, why you're doing what you're doing. How do we say like, you're not going to be, uh, you're, you're not going to be, um, uh, persuaded. You're not going to be, um, hmm, derailed. Okay. Isaac, stop that. Okay, boobies. 
I love you, Dole. Um, you're not going to be... overly invested you know maybe you used to be it's like you're gonna give minimal time and so yeah you know um i'm hearing something about a boeing airplane yeah you're not um involved as so involved you're, you're not so attached to the outcome we'll see you in the next video guys bye love and light healthy detachment